Hello, fluffy people of the world. My name is Liquid Blitz, and welcome back to Souls Dark, aka Dark Souls. Okay, so I'm exactly where I stopped last time because I I couldn't really leave this place. So I've done nothing since the last episode. Uh, let's do the courtesy check for some fucking walls. Seem to be the curse, the bane of my existence. Okay, so I think at the end of the last episode, I decided that this looks very sort of endgame-esque. Um, now, since the last episode and the end of the last episode, I'm sort of, I'm decided that I'm not going to keep going down. It seems very endgame to me, and I wouldn't be surprised if, like, going down to the Tomb of the Giants actually is endgame, and there's so much more I want to do first. That and the fact that I kind of want to go back up to the catacombs and see if I can find the, um the blacksmith that I was hearing, because clearly I missed that. Um, and then the fact that all signs seem to be pointing me towards Sen's fortress. Uh, and the fact that that's right next to the, like, the original blacksmith. It basically seems like Sen's fortress very much is where I need to go, and it's nowhere close to the end of the game, because it can't be. Do you know what I mean? Because it's so early on. So I've decided I'm going to Sen's fortress next. Um, rather than continuing down here. Um, I kind of, like, fell down here by accident. I, I, I defeated Pinwheel at the end of the catacombs and just sort of found myself get, just dropping down further and further and further, you know? And I kind of never wanted to come down here. Um, it didn't help that that arsehole kicked me into the fucking pit. Because um, by choice, I would have probably stayed there and then stopped and gone back up again and saved this for later. So... Basically, me going back up is, is just an extension of that. Uh, now, hang on just a second. Isn't this the very arsehole that kicked me into the pit? Hang on a second, how have I not seen him again? I'm confused. Have I, did I speak to him at the end of the last episode and I've just forgotten? Blimey. No, I didn't. You weren't supposed to survive that. Well, I did, bitch. I'll settle this once and for all. Is he gonna Lack fight me? Self-righteous cleric. Is it? Oh, we're just fixed now. Is this? It's just a fixed uh, fight. Some shit. What? What? What's going on? Oh, is that it? Are we just fighting now? Thanks for the feedback, by the way. You all let me know that this is patches, and he appears in every single game. I understand the implications now. Um. Well, I should probably kill him. But he seems too important to kill if I know he's coming up in all the future games. Oh, I can fucking hear something. I can- oh my god. Oh god, that's terrifying. <sighs> Fuck me. You know, this whole time I've been hearing something breathing in this, uh, in this Tomb of the Giants area. And I am- I am looking at it right now. What the fuck is that? Look at it! Is that a spider? Like a- like a, a friendly lady spider? Oh! Oh! Um, I might want my shield up here. Uh, is there any light in this place? No, fuck. Well, hang on, I want to go back up. I, I, I had it in my head that I'd made the decision to go back up. Um, now that might be the way up there. I don't want to keep going down. Uh, this is where he pushed me off the edge. Sorry, this is taking longer than I, I should be taking here. I, I'm confused at the geography of this place. How did I get back to that fireplace without speaking to this guy again? And without seeing whatever the fuck that thing is over there, that spider, uh, skeleton looking thing. How did I not run into that on the way back? You see what I mean? I don't want to just get into a fight now with this thing. Uh. Although, hang on, I kind of want to see what that is over there. It's an open window looking somewhere. Let's fight whatever the fuck this thing is. Um. I'm just going to toss a fireball. That is not what I meant to do. Oh, did I kill it? 
no word of a lie. I didn't mean to kill that with that. I meant to whip out a fireball. Right, okay. And we've got a door here. Uh, oh, God. Should I continue? Uh. Oh. Oh, right, okay. Well, there is loot nearby. Right, I'm gonna have to get my bearings here. There's there's loot to be had very nearby. Um, where did that guy go? Did he intentionally drop off? Oh god, what do we do? I'm all right. Um, make a decision. Come on, let's stop being a punk ass bitch. I want to go back up, but at the same time, there's all sorts of new shit right in front of my face, including um, a white fog door and a couple of bits of loot that are right in front of me. Well, it's nice to know that I can kill those things easily with a chaos storm, eh? Even if it's by accident. Right. I've got hum- uh, I'm human and I've got 35,000 runes here. I'm just going to click on this and s What the fuck is moving? Oh, that's a bonfire down there. I can't tell if it's a lit one or not. Oh, God. I don't know why I'm so indecisive. Fuck it. Fuck it. Light up. Ow. I might want to... Oh, right, I might want to throw on. Right, I'm going to do a running attack. Two hand. Ow. All sorts of ow. Fuck, I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm all sorts of dead. Goodbye, 35,000 runes and humanity. <laughs> Fucking what the fuck, man? What? Did you see that for a second there? Um. All right, okay. I'm in a I'm in a bind here. I need light, but I I sort of need a sh shield. I feel like as well. Um. Oh for fuck's sake! I knew I'd die. So that there was like a black knight there, or a golden knight, and there was also a big skeleton. Whoa, 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 whoa! Uh, prevail again. <laughs> Don't blame me, mate. Good, actually, goodbye, 35,000 runes. Oh, for fuck's sake, why didn't I level up with those runes? Right, okay, okay, just, just hold the fuck, what a sh, what a shit start to the episode. Fuck me. I've never started an episode with such shit before. I'm, I should have just gone up and committed to the plan. Um, I just thought that maybe that wouldn't be a boss door or whatever, and it would just open up a way, and I'd be able to get that loot real quick. Well, that zero, zero room... Right, what the fuck, man? Is he actually here? Hang on. How, I, I can't mentally grasp what is going on. Okay, for a start, when he first seemed to be getting agitated with me and he said that shit, he just vanished on the spot. So, point number one, where the fuck did he go for the, the first time round? And secondly, if he did fall down, wouldn't he have died? Or at least found his way back to me, even if he did fall down. So I thought he was just gone, or that was scripted or whatever. And then upon respawning, he's just here, and he insta-killed my ass. Fuck you! Fuck me, he's handing my ass to me, man. He's fast with that fucking thing, man. Uh, you know, I can't get stamina back while I've got the light up. It's, it's like... It's like I've got the shield up, if that makes sense. I'ma fucking kill this motherfucker. 
So he's at right, okay. I'm guessing because I chose I am the cleric, like saying yes, I am a cleric, he's just auto like fighting us. Like I can't there's nothing I can do about it. There was no way to defuse the situation. Um This is a real problem. Uh This is a problem. I, I can't use a shield, which is kind of like almost necessary against this guy. But I need the light up, so I need to one on my weapon. Oh. He's so fast with that fucking... Dude, this is such a problem. I can't... I can't... I could jump, jump back down. It's always he gonna jump down with me. Hang on, rest. I... Uh, oh, shit, man. This is honestly more challenging than any boss so far. He's fucking on my ass. What? Okay, okay, I can't even kick now. Fuck you. Get fucked. I'm finished. Yes, you are, bitch. Never. Go fuck yourself. For humanity. Crescent axe. Okay, thank you very much. Fuck him. I wonder if he... if you would always fight him, or if... you can be friendly with him, I don't know. I'll see you in Dark Souls 2. <laughs> right, okay. Um, I tell you, this whole lantern thing and not being... not having any light... without wasting a hand, a very important hand, to use it. Like, it's got- I can only use this light in my left hand, so I've got no shield if I want to use the light. Like raising your shield, your stamina stops coming back, basically. Same thing with the light, so if I want any illumination, I- my stamina isn't coming back. So I've got to let the light go out to get stamina back mid-fight? That is so painfully awkward. If I could just hook this onto my hip like you do in Elden Ring, that would have been fantastic. But this is actually painful. Um, those lights are changing color. This was red before. Right, so... So, okay. Oh, that spider guy's back. Um, so yeah, I got a, a white chunk, a white shard thing from nothing then when I died the first time and lost my runes. Right, I'm gonna do a running attack, but I need, I need this shit to connect. I'm fucking blind, though. And then I'm in his face, and... Uh, fucking hell, I can't see, man. I needed to do the lunging attack. There we go. Come at me. Fucking hell, it's tough. Right, um... Okay. Okay. <laughs> what a diabolical start to this episode. At least it wasn't a boss fog door. There is that. I think it's just a regular fog door. So that's gone now. Which is a good thing. Um... So I don't have to have a headache of losing my 35,000 runes, etc. in a fucking boss arena. Um, but I'm gonna do what I said I was gonna do. I'm gonna- I'm gonna sack everything off. I know there was some loot items right in front of me, and I wanna see what's- like... I saw that window out into a chasm, I want to know what that is, but... It will have to come later. Jesus Christ. I've lost my humanity, I've lost... 35,000 runes. I've died to a basic fucking bitch called Patches twice. To add insult to injury. Just trying to go forward, and I didn't even want to do that anyway. So let's let's completely sack that off. It will have to wait until later in the game. I'm sorry. I hope one of those loot items wasn't like great, and it's an absolute shame that I've just left it behind now. You know what I mean? Um, but it is what it is. I can't keep going. 
this light situation is is diabolically bad. Right, so I can go back up, and I do want to go back up, but there's, there's shit to do here. I'm hoping it's not too much of a ball like to get out of here. Um, I can climb back up here, so let's just see what's down here. What the fuck am I looking at? What the fuck? Climb back up, climb back up, climb my ass up! What the fuck was that a room full of? Oh, that was mildly terrifying. Okay, whatever it is, is, is loud. Is it coming up? Oh my god. It's all good as long as there's nothing that can shoot me. Right, we're, we're good, we're good. Let's just stop panicking. <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't. I was. I felt like I was so prepared for the for play, sitting down and playing this today, and then I sat down and started playing, and now I feel like I'm completely not prepared. Right. Oh Jesus! They can't climb up here, can they? You know, even with the light, I can't see. I think these are all just your regular big skeletons, dude. Look at that saw. That one has equipped. Oh, I wonder if that's actually a weapon you can loot. Whoa! Um. Shit, man. And I probably need to use my divine weapon here as well, don't I? Well, I'll tell you what, I mean... I've lost all my runes, as I always say. That sort of, it's the silver lining is I'm free to die and it doesn't matter. Do you reckon I can get those two bits of loot uh, before I die? And just intentionally lose the 2,000 runes? Hmm. Oh god, I wonder. But at the same time, Because I don't care about them, you know what I mean? Let's go, just fuck it. Just fuck it. Warn. Oh, fucking hell. I couldn't be... Jesus Christ. <laughs> All that for just a basic ass soul. Um, well, I kind of want the other item. If I, do, if I sprint, I should be able to get to it. <laughs> oh my god. And there's a few things I want to do this episode. I want to find that passage in the garden, by the way, before, just before I go to Sense Fortress, because I know that I missed a passage in the garden. That ledge where the loot item is? Yeah. Um, I want to try that before I go into Sense Fortress. And I want to find this blacksmith, and this might take me a while. Um, let's try and run over there. Oh, I got it. Um, Jesus. Right, okay, okay. Oh, fuck the, the brave soul that I got, but very much. Very, very much not fuck what I just got. Where is it? I saw what it was in that split second. Uh. That. Well, that's a fine how do you do. I'm glad I decided to try and get that. What a good decision for once. Ember for blacksmith weapon ascension. Large divine ember. I already had the divine ember. So what's large divine? Plus, ascends a plus five divine weapon and allows you to go to plus ten. Right. Okay, so it's just... Right. Okay, in that case, I wonder if... Like, you've... you've... Oh. Oh! Do all the specialties, all these embers and stuff, have a normal and then a large version? So large... For, that makes a lot of sense. Right! That makes so much more sense now. 
Because when I got the the large flame and the chaos flame, I was confused as shit at what it, what it meant by ascends plus five fire weapon allows reinforcement to plus ten. I just I thought that might have been a mistranslation uh, or something. Do you know what I mean? And it just made no sense until now. It's because I don't have the original flame ember. Right. I wonder if An Andre uses this, but because I didn't give him the original flame ember, I can't use this one. You know? Huh. And I need the regular flame ember because both chaos and large flame require a plus five fire weapon, so I desperately need the flame ember now. I, I assume. Huh. Okay. Right, okay. Right, let's get out of here. Once and for all. I'm not gonna get sidetracked by any more loot unless it's... ...like, blatantly gettable. With ease. Was that a dead end down there? It was so dark, I couldn't see. Um... I've got a feeling it will be a dead end in there. And I got all you need to get. Um... Now, this is not up, this is down, but I want to see what's down here. Hang on. I'm worried, actually. Um, I've got nothing to lose, fuck it. <laughs> I've got literally zero runes. And zero humanity or, or anything, so... Goodbye. Thanks for being chill, Mr. Bone Tentacles. I'm guessing this is actually the way out of the pit where he kicks you down. I'm guessing that's how you get out. Right, let's go. Let's just stay on the move. I need to stay on the move, but if I remember right, that... If I remember right, there are... Um... A few big skeletons on the way back. Oh god, how am I gonna do this? I'm definitely making the right decision here to leave now and come back later because I'm a bit too weak, even, even, like, even now, even, like, level 60 or whatever I am, I'm, I feel too weak for this area. Should I put a shield in my main hand? I've, I have not done that yet, but I need, um... I need light, so I cannot sacrifice my left hand. Can I raise both at once? Oh! Oh, never mind then. Okay, the shield doesn't block when it's in that hand. Okay. Uh... Oh, fuck, man. I've just gotta go for it. I've gotta just one-hand my weapon and, uh... Yeah. Okay, he just jumped off the edge then. That's fine. That's fine. I don't have to fight every single one. I've got 15 flasks, courtesy of that... Um... Empowered... Whatever you call it. Um... I'm gonna jump off and get that loot. I'm gonna get every bit of loot I can possibly grasp. Let's heal. Right, okay. Just climb. Take a hit and climb. Ow. That's a big old arrow sticking out of me. Oh my god. I need to heal. Can I heal on the la- Oh, you can't. Right, okay. That's- that's very helpful. I guess the- the darkness thing is... The silver lining is they can't see you as well until you're too close. Which is a good thing. Um, I wonder if I can run and like running attack here, or better yet, just start fireballing some motherfuckers. I can just. I'm I'm pressing the lock on key. I can just lock on. I think before they are in aggro range. There you go. That's perfect. 
I've noticed that these um, skeletons don't come back. Like, I'm not using a divine thing. I wonder if it's because there's no um, necromancer. Ladder there, okay. Mm -hmm. I think it'll all be okay. Panic over. I don't know if I am too weak or I've just made a bunch of bad decisions so far, but I do feel underleveled, so I'm, I'm happy with my decision to get out of here for now. Oh, fuck. Well, that's a bad idea. There must be another way of lighting up than using this this thing. There must be. A way of lighting an area up without wasting a, a hand. Uh, I mean, I, did, I, I, did, I didn't see what I just got then. What was that? Shit. Oh, fuck me. What was that? Hmm. Well, fuck, I'll have to watch my recording back later. I'd love one of those scimitars, though. Whatever they're called. Speaking of, I was thinking more about different, like, ascensions, like lightning and fire and shit. And I want a lightning weapon as soon as I can get one, really. And I was thinking of making the Zweihander my next specialty weapon. Um, thanks for letting me know, someone, that the Black Knight weapons you can't upgrade. So that dream is gone, sadly. There we go. Well, you know what? I got a few of these loot items on the way back up. Which is good. Those are all the ones that I missed as I just slid down to the bottom of the abyss. Okay. Any more that I actually missed? Okay. Right. Since we're about to re-enter this motherfucking place. Um, Divine Halberd. I've got several weapons which would be great to use, like Black Knight Great Axe, etc. And I just got that Crescent Axe, didn't I, off uh, patches. So what is it? You well used old bronze battle axe with a long hilt and a crescent shaped blade, one of the blessed weapons of the Way of the White. Oh, is it a divine weapon? It is. Okay. I should just, I should just throw it away and piss on it, just to insult patches a little bit more. The Crescent Axe is bequeathed to cleric warriors who have proven their faith. Okay. So yeah. I've turned the, the Halberd to Divine, which is one thing. Um, I can't upgrade the Black Knight weapon, I don't think, so... I wanted to make that my fire and then chaos weapon. But I don't think I can, so that's out of the question now. Uh, I might reserve the Black Knight sword I've been using just for my main non-specialty weapon, you know? I've got the Zweihander, I've got multiple other weapons. Uh, isn't it true that it's the weapons that re that upgrade with the Twinkling Titanite that you can't turn into a specialty weapon? Like lightning or whatever. Um, and Zweihander isn't, so I can upgrade the Zweihander. I'd like to upgrade my stamina a bit more though. Because the Zweihander's a bit fucking... Uh, now hang on, is this going to put me into roly hell? <laughs> I don't need the light anymore, so that can fuck off. Uh, well, let's just commit. It is, isn't it? I can feel it. What the fuck? Okay, this- the way mobs and pathing and shit works in this game is a bit strange. Every now and then I'll get an item or runes from a guy dying and I've no idea what happened to them. Right. Okay, I might heavily edit this whole catacomb segment. Uh... Because I just want to find that blacksmith. Um... 
But I need to take my time or I'll never... You th I, I tell you what, the running attack with this halberd is great for these ones. Oh, fucking Jesus, man. Eat, drink, heal, just fuck. Yeah. Because I've already done most of the catacombs, I'm just going to try and skip through a lot of it from this point on. Um, and I'm going to take my time because I don't want to die to all these roly fuckers. Or should I just go for it and run past them? I've already ran the gauntlet once before. Um, shit. Fuck. I've got a problem here. <laughs> My one hand isn't high enough damage. Let's go for it. Fuck it, sometimes you just gotta go for it. I'm doing good. I'm doing good, ladies and gentlemen. We're doing fantastic. Run past the archers that are behind me. Climb up. Here we go. That's how you do it. Okay. Um. By the way, um, yeah, a few people commented saying I missed something in this area. Um, and I think I know what it is. I just don't know where it is. Oh, shit. Um. It is what it is. I'd rather people tell tell me than didn't tell me, but I think it's a way of joining another covenant, I think. Um. And I just vaguely know it's something to do with that titanite demon that I killed. Um, in here. Uh, so let's just check this area out. I'm pretty sure I checked everywhere for illusory wall, so I don't think it's an illusory wall. Oh! <gasps> fuck! Oh, heart attack! Oh, my heart can't take it. Heal. This is no time for fun and games. Where the fuck did he come from? <sighs> Jesus. What? Nestle in coffin, I guess I found it. Right. I did wonder if some of these open graves might be... something. And I did already have that thought, because I remember in Elden Ring, it's a way of tele... like, uh... kind of teleporting to new locations and shit. There's a couple of times in that game where you get inside a coffin and you just go somewhere else. I mean... Why not? Let's just have a little bit of a rest in here, shall we? <laughs> I wonder if something happens. <sighs> okay. Nothing happened. <laughs> right over. Now nothing has happened, has it? Hmm. I wonder if I've missed my opportunity to do something, like like I should have done this before killing Pinwheel or something, you know? Uh I mean, when you when you pretend to be an egg in the bird's nest to get back to the asylum, you, that does take a, a like a like a minute to kick in, you know. So let's just sit here. <laughs> let's enjoy death, shall we? <sighs> oh, there you go. You're fucking dead. Oh my god. Okay. Cutscene? Am I beginning to, like, be teleported somewhere? That's a yes. That's what that is. 
I might want to do a better job from now on of just checking all the walls and, like, the environment, because I keep missing things like this. You know, I'm actually surprised I didn't see this, uh, interactable when I killed that Titanite demon. I usually check most of the walls out, you know what I mean? Oh, shit. What, I'm just straight- ah, oh, for fuck's sake, say it ain't so! I- I knew it had something to do with a covenant, not the fact that it would- What the fuck was that sound? I thought it had something to do with a covenant, not being sent all the way down into the tomb of the giant skin. Do- do I really have to climb my way out again? Oh my god. Honestly, I thought I- I thought I- Okay, something dark is moving in front of my eyes. I'll- I'll confront that in a second. Jesus Christ. Boss or friendly guy? I really thought, right, okay, we're going to Sense Fortress next, so I'll quickly get out of here, get through the catacombs, find the blacksmith pretty quick, and all that would be done in like 10 minutes. I should have known. I should have fucking known. I'd spend the first two hours just trying to get out of here. And now I send myself back down. Okay, hello, gigantic blade that I can see. Pray to the... Pray to the sarcophagus grave lord. I'm... I'm committing to my chaos servant spider ladies, by the way, but I still want access to the covenant, you know? Like, officially add it to the list at the bonfire. Oh god, if I... right, if I enter covenant, officially, am I abandoning the spider ladies? Um, I just hit leave. Oh god. Hang on, Grave Lord? Isn't that, uh... Something to do with PvP? Is that a PvP covenant? Well, you know, I think that you can rejoin covenants, so... Let's enter covenant, whatever it does, and then I can always rejoin and beg for forgiveness from the Lady Spiders. Oh, achievement unlocked, Covenant, Gravelord Covenant. Right, I think I'm going to say no to that, and I'm praying it will just add it to the list so I can always switch later if I want to. I reckon, because the achievement popped up, I think I will have access to it now. Um, but yeah, I'm, I'm not going to worry too much about that. I'm pretty certain Grave Lord is something to do with PvP. Um, by the way, how the fuck? <laughs> Can I rest? Can I go to sleep again? Yes. Okay. I'm praying we appear back in the very same spot. <laughs> because if you tell me I've got to climb up again, you can go fuck yourself. <laughs> I would uninstall before I've got to climb back out of the Tomb of the Giants again. Whew. I'd love to see the face of the one who transports you. Yes, thank God for that. Okay. Um... We'll get back to the campfire, because I want to see officially if, uh, yeah, I want to see officially if I can join it now at, the, at any bonfire. And then I'm going to go radio silence and I'm going to find the blacksmith, basically. And I, if, to you guys, I'll just jump cut to the moment I actually sort of find it. Because it's, it's going to take me ages to find the fucking thing. I've rested at the bonfire, got a few flasks back, but most importantly, if I die, I'll respawn here, and not all the way back down into the Tomb of the Giants. Anyway, back to the search. Oh, 
wonder if you can fall down here safely. I've got one more prism stone. I'm I'm tempted to try. And doesn't this light up the area anyway? Fuck it. You see, that's not too far down. I reckon I can survive that fall. I'm gonna heal to fall though before I jump down here. Considering there's a skeleton down here. Oh, thank God for that. I mean, Christ, that's hard to know. <laughs> Jesus. Um, considering it was pitch black. Oh, Jesus. Shard, thank you. <sighs> Fucking hell. Oh, God, what's down here? There's something trying to slice at me. Oh, God, help me. Oh! Cutscene? Oh, my God. Where are we? Big boy! He's not fat, he's just big boned. He's got a pickaxe, man. Oh, my God. Oh, well, thank you for opening the... Sh the, the Oh, he's friendly! Hello! Literally big boned. First skeleton I've ever seen that's actually big boned. Whoa! I mean, f right. Um, um, um. Right, okay, I need to kill these guys before I can rest of there. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. Right, okay. Right. Is this the blacksmith then? Is he a skeleton? Cool. Well, okay then. I'm so I'm sorry if I just killed your friends. I wasn't expecting that. I figured we would just be getting that, you know, the uh, item, that green shard. Not finding the blacksmith and a big old skeleton smith at that. Hello. I admire your shiny big bones, sir. Mm. My, is that an ember from New Londo? And a fine ember it be. Which ember is that? Say, why not leave it with me? Is I'll it? give you a flame to feast your eyes upon. Is his vo- Oh, right. Is his voice supposed to sound like a McDonald's drive through microphone? It sounds very weird. Um... I'm hoping this can't also be given to, like, Andre, because... Fuck it. Yes, yes, very well. We'll get these old bones to work. <laughs> I hope my sound isn't just fucked, but his voice is proper distorted. Um, but let's see what he's got to say. I'm here to smith, not to chit-chat. I've told you, I'm here for the trade, not for the talk. There's some- there has to be something wrong with that voice. It's pro super, like, guitar distortion on it. Enough with your presence. It disturbs me. Let's just roll with it. Um, so, okay. You can buy some bones, shards, and some bolts. Okay, that's fine. Well, since I'm here, uh, let's look at his modification. I don't have a, an ascended fire weapon, so there's nothing to do, obviously. Um, okay. So, I'll remember that going forward, once I've upgraded to plus five fire, I've got to come back to this dude. Well, what was that about? Don't be coming up. And a very oh, it's a different one. Could it be the flame of the legendary witch? Chaos? I know. Supposing old Vamos would never let you down. Is that his name, Old Vamos? Not ever. Right, so, okay. Yes, my... Right, so he's the Chaos. That's Chaos, that's Fire. And both require a plus five fire weapon. So, I'm guessing your regular Flame Ember goes to Andre. And then this guy ups a, a plus five fire weapon to either Higher Fire. <laughs> higher Fire. Or chaos. At least I know now. Well, you are a persistent one, are you not? But I'm afraid I'm a mere blacksmith. It's just me and my trade. I would be of no help to a righteous warrior such as yourself. 
I'm tempted to Google if his voice should be like that. I've told you, if I have anything, to... I'd be of more help with that ember from New London, of course. It's a shame the whole place was flooded. That's right. Okay, well, well, you see, you say you're not here to talk, and then you just give me a nugget of information like that. So there's a... There's an ember of some type in New Londo, the the ghost town. I'm tempted to go back there soon, but I'm I'm gonna commit to what I said. I'm gonna go to Sen's fortress first. I've told you, I have nothing. If I have anything, to, speaking honestly, I must say that I'm at my very limit. There's no more work to be done. Ah, unless I have the flame of that legendary witch. Isn't that? That will require a visit to Lost Isolith. Impossible. Hang on, so he's, he's... Right, he's saying he's got nothing to say and then he's speaking. <laughs> and then he's got no, no new information for me and then he's at the peak of his limit and then he goes and tells me about two more embers he can use. One in Lost Isolus and one in New Londo. This guy is lying <laughs> and got, he's got plenty of info. Right, okay. Okay. Um... I repaired before I started this episode, so that's fine. Any upgrades I can do right now? Oh, actually, yes, there is. Twinkling Titanite. Um, well, you know... Twinkling Titanites are only for non-special weapons, and I've kind of committed to this sword now. I think I'm just going to put both points into that. Plus four, hell yes. Right, okay. Cool. If that'll be all, then be gone with you. Well, thank you for that. I appreciate your help, sir, and I'll be back once I've got a plus five flame weapon. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Which way is it? Is it... Pro moves? That's not fair. That's not fair, dude! Really? Really? I couldn't... Oh, okay. I just, I want to make one thing clear to you right here and now. I was fully trapped in that death animation there. I couldn't roll or raise my shield. Once he hit me one time, I was truly dead permanently. Let's get out of here. And never return. Until I've got a f fire weapon. What a miserable place this catacombs is. <laughs> Fuck it forever. Now let's actually get out of here. Without falling down any holes. Oof. I'll be glad to see the back of this place. I might try and just run out, just straight up, run past everything. Fuck off. If I can just jump down here. I think this is where I came from. Yes, it is. I remember, this is close to the beginning. Just let me live and let me leave. Just fuck it. Let, just fuck off. I'm never coming back here again. Fuck fire weapons and chaos weapons. Um, oh, there was a thing down there. Let's just go. Let's just fucking... Goodbye, sir. You bony shits. Oh god, no. This is not fair, dude. Ah! 
Fuck me. You know, I really hate... If there's one single thing, one problem I've got with this game... And I'll admit, the, the list of problems I've got with this game is very, very small. It's otherwise exceptional. But if there's one problem I've got, it's that the... I don't know if, I don't know if you'd describe it as the hitboxes or what. Um, oh, let's just go for it, fuck it. The, the hitboxes are basically... Like... They're, they're, they're too large. Hang on, oh shit. They're too large for these skeletons. Like, you, you can't run past them. Like, to, to run past the skeleton, the path needs to be, like, surprisingly wide, so I ca I couldn't get past that skeleton on the uh, pathway there. Even though, clearly, there is room. You, you, you just can't officially get past them. So I'm taking a break here. Well, let's reset and I'll kill everything on the way out. Okay. I should have known, you know what I mean? It wouldn't be that simple to just run past everything. That's one down. I should have stopped. But that's it. Once you run into, what, like, a... a mob on a path like that, you're basically fucked. Until you've got to kill it. But if, if you're being chased by, like, 20 mobs at the same time... Then you're kind of trapped, because you've got 20 mobs running behind you. And then one in front, and your shield can only block one direction. <laughs> Shields aren't all powerful. That's what I get for trying to rush away from all these mobs. Instead of killing them. Like a professional. Die. Right, I can smell freedom, I think. I'm good. There might be one more skeleton. Nope, we're good. Oh my god, there's daylight. <laughs> I can smell freedom. <laughs> oh, who the fuck would elect to go back down there? Fuck fire weapons and chaos weapons. Everything can f Oh, look at those tail feathers. I've missed this big old bird. Hello. Freedom. Is that friendly snake still here? Oh, the terrifying but friendly snake. Hello. Now, I haven't done anything particularly big since I last spoke to him, so he shouldn't have anything new for, new for me. Jesus Christ, what a... Colossal ball like every, all of this is. <laughs> so I know there's an ember down in uh, New Londo, but we'll get there after Sense Fortress. So let's go up and go, get back to Andre. Anything new for me? Hello, terrific and pray. No, okay. Fire guy is still gone. I'll go back down and upgrade my pyromancy at some point. Um, back in Blight Town and Quelag's area. Um, but I'll probably wait again, I'll wait until after Sense Fortress, because we need to go through that big door of light down in Demon Ruins anyway, so we are going to be going back there. Um, and I'll pro I might go back down there immediately after Sense Fortress. It sort of depends if uh, Sense Fortress gives me whatever I need to get through that door of light, you know? I'm tempted, actually, to pop a couple of humanity. Um, in fact, I will do. Because I want to go human for Sense Fortress. Or is that stupid? Decisions, decisions. What the fuck? Hell, I heard something else as well as that 
person there. Uh, okay, well, let's say hello. Where did this person come from? Oh, is this the lady from uh, the catacombs? Hello. It is! I will never forget what you did. Huh. I am deeply indebted. For it is not within my power to save Vince or Nico. I cannot thank you enough. No, Please don't mention it. Heard. I am Rhea of Thorland. I only wish there was some way I could help you. Your mouth isn't moving. I am inexperienced and I only know the art of miracles. If that oh. could really help, speak to me again. Okay, any miracles for me? I, st I need to love put a couple of points into intelligence because I can't use any of the miracles. Would a miracle be of any help to you? I would be most pleased if that were so. May we discuss miracles then? Ooh, right. I uh, I need the I need the bathroom, and I just need to take a five minute break after that clusterfuck that was the catacomb. So uh, I'll I'll skip forward for you guys. Right, we are back, and uh, yeah, let's continue talking to her. And to finish my point, um, I'm, I want to go human for Sen's Fortress for any invasions that happen in there. Um, now, somebody did say that invasions tend to happen closer to, like, the main boss area, um, which means I probably need to get through most of the Sen's Fortress before any invasion would happen anyway, so, I'm, so I might not want to. But I also kind of want to kindle the Andre fireplace a little bit more, maybe up to 15 flasks. Um, and I've got like, f since I killed that patch motherfucker, he gave me four more humanity in addition to the four I've got. So I've got quite a few humanities to use. Prince and Nico were fooled by a lout named Patches and turned into hollow. I killed that motherfucker. Did them no good. It is my ignorance, my frailty that has sealed their fates. Perhaps Petrus realized my weakness all along. Who's Petrus? And made the decision to abandon me. I can hardly blame him now. Is Petrus that big round guy back at the Firelink Shrine? Well, don't worry, I killed that Patches bitch. Until he reappears in Dark Souls 2. Vince and Nico were fooled by oh. my is and thus I can hide. I wonder if I can speak to, I don't know if that, that Petrus is the dude that's down below me, but I wonder if I can actually um, talk to him and send him up. I don't know. Prayer. Cool. Purchase item. F Divine Blessing. Fully restore HP and undo irregularities. Holy water from Goddess Guinevere. Fully restored. The goddess of sunlight, Guinevere, daughter of the great lord of sunlight, Gwyn, is cherished by all as the symbol of bounty and fertility. Mm-hmm. Uh, oh. Oh, that's... Oh, sorry, that's not a spell. That's just an item. What? Say what? So that's like a free... Estus Flask, plus it undoes irregularities, so I'm guessing that's poison and shit. Uh, it only costs a thousand. Hmm. I'll remember that she's got that. Heal, Great Heal, Homeward Force. These are the same spells as that dude down at Firelink Shrine. Homeward Force. Wrath of the Gods sounds interesting. Powerful shockwave. Ooh. Magic barrier. Well, I'm not overly bothered. I'll remember that she's got him. Oop, no. Okay. Prince and Nico were fooled by a lout named Hat My Okay. Well, I'll try speaking to that guy down there, see if he's got anything new for me, see if I can send him back up to her to become friends again or whatever, but for now. I've got a mission to accomplish. And that mission is to find that G darn path in the garden and then head to Sen's Fortress. Andre. I'm, uh, yeah, I'm sincerely hoping I, that flame ember and whatever, the chaos one, uh, was specifically for that, that skeleton blacksmith and not Andre. If it, yeah, no, yeah, because I had those when I last spoke to Andre, so yeah, you can't use them. Oh! oh. Divine! 
brilliant ember you have there. It must be the large divine. Oh, I'd let you the embers used for the secret rites of divine blacksmiths. Perhaps you could let I've longed. Yes. Okay, so he handles both regular divine and large divine. Oh, I wonder then if Skeleton Blacksmith has the regular fire as well. If this guy has regular and large divine, it would stand to reason the other one would have regular and large fire. That's a ball lake if it's true. Thank you, Andrea. Andrea Vastora never disappoints. Um, well, I've got nothing I can upgrade, but yeah. Ah, uh, oh right, that's, you can tell by the symbols, that's divine and that must be large divine. So if I upgrade my divine halberd another three times to plus five, I'm guessing I would, it would pop up on this page here. Uh, what's it take, anyway? That's a pain, though, that... All your fire and chaos ones go to that other blacksmith, because that, that's a horrible blacksmith to get to. Oh my god, think about that. It's at the bottom of the catacombs. Just to get back to the motherfucker, you've got to go through the entire catacombs to get to him. What a horrific ball egg. Um, and green titanite shards, I believe, are used for fire as well, aren't they? I'll be seeing you then. Let me just double check. I don't want to waste them all on upgrading my Divine Halberd if I need that for fire. Yeah, fire. Right, okay, I'll... Uh... Plus... Hang on, red Titanite Chunk is n plus nine fire. That's plus five fire. Reinforces fire weapons to plus five. Fire weapons... Right, okay. So yeah, I need that for fire. I'll save that then. Anything new to say? You need it. I know little of the dark root, although I've heard rumors of those who get stumped in the catacombs. See? Understood. I know little right, okay, okay. I think we're good to go. Yes, sir, re Bob. I'll be okay. Then. Now, I'm gonna search for this path in the gardens before I go human and, and shit. Because knowing me, I'm going to fall to my death multiple times. <laughs> uh, so I'll save that humanity shit for when I get to the Sense Fortress. Now, this is first time using a plus four sword. This must be high damage. The real question is, can I kill with a single running attack with one-handed attacks? Yes! Get wrecked. Nice. I had to use it two-handed before. Now, let's try and work through the logic of this shit. This item I want is up there. Oh, let's kill these. Okay. So I need to get up there. Possibly, like, round the back up there. But there is nothing, there is no connective tissue anywhere here. Um, the only bit of land that connects is this, but I'm guessing here that this is to jump back down here, from up there. So there's no way up there, and no connective shit anywhere. So... You must get up there for- oh shit, hang on. You must get up there from over that bridge somewhere. You must. So I'll go up there. Actually, thinking about it, one guy did say, check out that area with the stone dudes a bit closer. I'm gonna go ahead and guess here. Uh, that means there's a path that I missed or something. Ooh. 
Nice and easy. I, I promise you we'll get to Sense Fortress soon. <laughs> Real soon. Um, now, just vaguely speaking, the direction I want to go to get to said path is in this sort of direction. Uh, is this... Oh, is that just a snake? Oh my god, no. Right, okay. Okay. I just saw the gap behind it and thought it was a... Right. Ah. You know, I noticed pathway. I, I swear on my life I didn't know that was there. I just knew that there was a way somewhere to get to that ledge with the item on it. What the fuck is that? I guess that's what people were saying, how in this game there are there are illusory walls which you have to attack uh, and not roll into. But it's not an illusory wall, it's just sort of a tree I could chop down. When I first hit that there, I thought there was one of those snake lizards on the other side of it and I just couldn't see him. Hello! Oh my god, what is this? Ugly bastard! Ugly, flappy land ray. It does kind of look like I look like a ray. Oh, I'd love a pet one of these just roaming around the garden. Green blossom. What was that? Da -da 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 -da. Temporary boost to stamina recovery speed. Oh. Um. Okay, I'll I'll keep it. When are you going to want stamina recovery the most? Either when you're rolling a lot, or you've got a lot of shit to block at, I guess. Hmm. All right, so these trees are actually like attackable things, then I guess. Um. Can they hurt you? I don't want to kill a tree unnecessarily, you know? Hang on, let's kill these flowery tree bitches. Oh. Hang on. This one's dead already. Well, that's where I came from. Is that tree going to block my way <laughs> once I've left the area? You have my uh, promise that going forward, I'm going to be more attentive. Like, I always thought I was attentive. Hello! <laughs> I've always tried to be attentive, but I keep missing basic shit that I shouldn't be missing. So I'm going to check, like, all edges of all walls from now on. And if there's any gaps behind, like, trees or... Oh, fuck. Ow. He, he just took my running attack there in stride. Damn. In the back. <laughs> That's a very cool creature. Like a toadstool lizard ray. Anyway. So yeah, from now on I'm going to roll at almost all flat walls. Some of the non-flat walls. And I'm going to keep my eyes open for possible interactables like that grave thing. And also if there's any gaps behind any trees or whatever. I'm just going to try and be more attentive because I've missed too many things. And it's upsetting. Uh... No wall? Okay. Okay, let's go up that path then, once we've gone over here. Those green blossoms, if you farm quite a bunch of them, might be really handy for like... 
when you're in the catacombs and you're gonna fight 70,000 skeletons and you're constantly blocking and rolling and shit. Oh, let's go. I wonder if I'm gonna get anything special, like a flame ember or something. That's the only thing holding me back from having a fire or a chaos weapon. Ooh. That's two hand this motherfucker. Good night. Oh, is this it? Right. Okay. Is this good? Wolf ring. Um, boosts poise. One of the special rings granted to the four knights of Gwyn. The wolf, the wolf ring belongs to Artorius the Abyss Walker. Artorius had an unbendable will, will of steel and was unmatched with the great sword. Um, how much does it boost your poise? Uh, 40. Oh, it, give you, it gives you 40 right off the bat. Well, that's pretty fucking good. Now, poise is... Um... Is poise where... Um... If I get hit whilst I am mid-attack, the more poise I've got, the less likely I get stumbled and my attack cancels and fails. Isn't that true? I can run and jump. Uh, well... Let's try... Oh, God. Do we try? <laughs> eee Fucking Jesus. Okay, right. Good. I'll keep it on. So, I've got on the... The... Havel's ring, which gives me better... E equip load. Um... I'm wondering if there's anything I missed in the basin, actually. I can always come back. Hmm. I'm wondering, then, if different enemies in the game have different attack amounts, or, or whatever you want to call it, where, uh, you know, like, I only need, like, 20 poise to withstand an attack from a basic bitch skeleton, but I need, like, 60 poise to stand a much stronger attack, you know? I'm wondering... I'm wondering if 40 poise is enough for the basic enemies to not stumble me when I'm attacking them. I guess we shall see. Because so far, with my zero poise, every single light attack from a skeleton has interrupted me. Which means I need to get distance. It's why I've started, like, running away and doing, like, a running attack. Um, because as soon as they attack, I'm just getting stumbled. Um, right. Ten flasks. It might be a waste to go human this early. I probably want to do it further into the Sense Fortress, don't I? Um... It depends how many humanity items I've got. We'll decide. If I've got more than five, I'll go human here and now. Yeah. And I want to kindle, um, this up to plus fifteen. Uh, so let's do another one. If you've got them, use them. Reverse hollow, bosh. I'm alive! And let's kindle to plus 15. I'm tempted to try kindling to, like, more than that. Huh. Shall I try? I haven't gone to plus 20. Fuck it. If it doesn't work, then I've just got one extra humanity for the the increased item drop rate, I suppose. Be cool if it turns out you can get to plus 20. It looks like it's working. Hey! Plus 20! Can you go to plus 25? 
I'll stop there because I don't want to start just pissing through all my humanity, but that sounds like I can go even further than 20. Dude. Nice. Okay. Right, here we go now. Sense Fortress awaits. If you've jumped ahead and you've just joined us, welcome. I've been going everywhere. I've got the, the items I missed from the garden. I've done a few bits and bobs. Uh, big fat head guy is gone, by the way. Okay, right. Okay, before we continue. <laughs> Whoa! Okay. So, yeah, we know this guy is- uh, this place is full of traps and shit. What the fuck? Oh my god. Okay, we've got snake heads. Snake head warriors. Right. Fortunately, I seem to be quite tough. Oh, they can bite me. Right, it's a three, two or three hit kill. Nice. Cool design, by the way. It's like these were men, but they've, they've been cursed by some snake god. Like that big snake back at Filing Shrine. Okay, so. Oh, are those black knights up there? Hello? Well, I'm mildly terrified. I already know that this, is, this place is like one big uh, Indiana Jones movie, isn't it? With all the traps and shit. That's what that big snake guy said, I, I think. Isn't it? I know we've got traps in Sense Fortress, but I can't remember where I know that from. I think Snakey Boy told us. These look like Crucible Knights. Um, oh fuck. Oh boy, look at this shit, man. Oh, ho, ho, this, this looks fun. Uh, oh my god, okay, we've got a titanite demon down there. Okay. Please tell me he's not going to be firing light up at me. Dude, okay, I'm a fan of, of this place. This looks awesome. <laughs> Honestly, this might end up being my, uh... <laughs> this might end up being my thumbnail. I'm gonna, uh, take my camera off. Right, I'm sure I've got a thumbnail in there somewhere. Just so people know what I'm doing this episode. Woo! Right, stage one complete. I got doors and stuff down there. I wonder if you can... Okay, I can hear footsteps. That's not a good thing. I wonder if you can do the, uh, the falling attack on this Titanite demon and, like, do it at the same time as you die from fall damage. Do you see what I mean? But kill him in the process? Because it is super high damage is the, is the falling attack. Stage two, complete. Stage three, complete. Got some arsehole firing, uh, firing shit at me. Dude, I like the look of, uh... Oh, you can't see under my camera. The look of his bow in his hand, it's like... It's like a spindly looking... Oh, it's not a bow, it's a... What's he firing at me? Oh, it's just magic. Okay, right, gotcha. Time to go. Okay, these statues are so gonna come to life or do something horrific later on. Since I've, uh, I don't know, maybe I should have put more points, uh, used some of my souls, and then leveled up, but... 
I'm gonna uh, right. I'm gonna be a professional here. It's time to stop sucking ass and actually get good and uh, and survive until the first bonfire. Um, I was considering using another humanity just to increase my item drop rate since I'm already wasting one humanity. Uh, but uh, it's all good. Um, let's whip out the shield and see how much damage I block. Okay. Is this my magic reduction one? Yes, it is. Okay, good. Hang on, let's... I need to time this right. Are they, uh... One, two... I'm so gonna f die here. Uh... Let's... I need more of an angle. Um... How much gap is between them up there? You see what I'm saying? One, two, right. There's a gap in the in the middle of these four swinging axes. I'm gonna run past the first two, block a hit with my shield, and then just running attack him. I think. One. I think it's the same amount of time. I'll block another one if I need to. I've got all the time in the world. Just take my time. Fuck you. Die! Whew. Right. Is that thing about to fire arrows at my face? Just keep my shield raised. Oh, I see. I see. The little raised square on the floor there. I see. Um. Oh, okay. What have we got here? Large titanite shard. Thank you. Oh, by the way, I'd love weapon suggestions if you if you guys have got any for what I can turn into all my special weapons, like a lightning weapon, a fire weapon, etc. Um. If you've been watching my playthrough so far, you'll probably know some of the weapons I've got. So if any of them are particularly awesome, I'm open to suggestions. I'm thinking Zweihander, if I can increase my stamina a little bit further. Maybe the um, other halberd. The gargoyle halberd. Or maybe something else, like a big axe or something. I'd also quite like a fast sword as well. Because um, I reckon that will go hand in hand with a shield fantastic. Have some sort of scimitar or some other small sword, rather than a slow great sword like I'm using right now. Okay, he's just watching me from down there. You know the fireball; it doesn't go a great horizontal distance, but I think it might go downwards a long way. I'm half tempted to toss a chaos fireball down there, um, but I'll refrain. It's all good. Whoa! <laughs> uh, okay, I don't know if I if it's. Whoa! 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 Right. <gasps> Before I was interrupted by boulders hitting snake men, I was going to say, what are the actual chances I get through the entire Sense Fortress without dying once in, a, in my first ever playthrough? That would be a uh, ultimate, like, you know. Oh, I see the ball up there. I see that. Hello. That would be the ultimate boast if it's a hard thing to do on your first playthrough. I think these, but yeah, these balls are actually pushed by guys, aren't they? Well, it did barely any damage to that first lizard guy. Oh god, I hope there aren't any. Uh... Oh, I 
Oh shit, man. Oh, I don't like the fact that Titanite Demon is right under this. I hope, like, bridges can't collapse and so on. Um. Right, okay. That ball is coming my f... f is... The ball is gone. Why is the ball gone? Did, did I summon it? Hang on. By getting down here. Okay, that ball is appearing and disappearing. See, it's gone again. What the fuck? I'm going to watch that ball in the top left now. Ah, oh, right. Okay. I was going to go for this guy, but I don't want that ball on my ass. Right, I don't think it's coming down here. That's not an illusory wall. I'm surprised that ball's not coming this way, honestly. Uh, Mr. Snake, can you fuck off? <laughs> Just get off me, you clingy bastard. You needy bastard. Okay, right, what's the crack? What's going on? Oh, we can go down. Um, I apologize. I apologize if my camera's covering, like, lots of shit in the top right corner. Um... I, I'm tempted to use a flask and get to full health. Cause that missing bit of health might save my life if I get bouldered. Um... Can I get off to the side just down there? Yes, I can. Let's see what's down the side here. Fucking hell, did you see that? I decided to slide right off. Ah, ooh, 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 ooh. Right, I'm, I'm glad I've upgraded the damage of this weapon by one further. Uh, did you see, by the way, d did I just get hit once without stumbling then? That, that, that all happened a bit fast, but I think that 40 poise ring might have actually helped. Um, well, well, we know where Onion Head guy is. Let's just hope I don't get bouldered off the edge here, yeah? or fall off the edge, or the bridge doesn't crumble or some shit. Yes, that's right. We're rolling at every fucking chunk of wall. <laughs> right. Anything new for me? Hello. Mmm. 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 Where did you come from? Splendid news, I tell you. <laughs> his voice is muffled because of his helmet. What's his splendid news? Mmm. 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 Ah, so you see my sight. Mmm. I've run up against the wall. Or a ball, to be precise. Hmm. I'm a bit too tough to be up running those things. <laughs> so here I sit in quite a bit of... Too plump. Nose. Perhaps we'll have another development. Don't worry, I'll handle the ball if you uh, agree to help me later. You know, I'm talking shit and just being hilarious, but uh, actually, if that is a thing, if I help him out and then I can summon him for a boss later, I might... This might be the first actual summon that I use in the game. Perhaps I could try some rolling. Bah, no chance. My head would spin. He is kind of roly poly and round. Rolling might be easier for him. Perhaps, bah. Hmm. Right. Well, I can see a bit of loot up there. So I need to jump off to get that, clearly. Or is that a hint for try rolling at the wall? Because I can't. I can't roll out of the way of the ball. The ball is taking up the entire width of the path. And by the way, when I got onto that bit there, I was sliding off to my death. The, the run and the jump is what saved me. Oh, 
Oh, right, sprinting is enough. Right, okay. One, two, three, four, five. That's enough time. Right, okay. That's enough time to get to that hole. Go, 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 there's no limit. I want to kill that motherfucker. Um, it's a shame you've got to go through these fog walls. Um, I don't want to get bald accidentally here. Oh! <laughs> get flattened, motherfucker. Um, mm, I'm gonna heal to full, you know. I don't. I don't trust myself, and I've got twenty flasks. Ooh. Right. Do we commit to Jesus? Do we go up there first or the fog door first? Let's see if we can turn these off first before we go through fog door. Because that might be a boss door for all I know, you know. If ever there's a place to use a shield, it's this place. Ground gonna collapse or something bullshit? I don't trust it at all. At all! Ring of Steel Protection. Uh... What is that one? Well, that is so loud, I apologize. Christ. Boost defense versus physical attacks. That sounds good to me. Um. Hmm. Right, I really like the poise ring if it means I can get off some attacks while being hit. That solves a lot of my problems, does the wolf ring. Um, let's see how much my physical goes up once I put the ring on. It's 170 right now. 172 to 220. That's not a good enough improvement to get rid of 40 poise. I've got to be honest. I like the 40 poise much more. Okay. Um. Uh, well, I do want to get that loot that's down there before I go through the fog door. Got it next time. I've got to be careful though. Whew. There's some spikes there as well. Shuttle. Isn't that the name of a lightsaber? What is that? I need to put some of these away. Shuttle slash curved sword. It's, it scales with dexterity. Um, curved, da, 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 created by R Store, Earl of Karim. Requires great skill to wield, but evades shield defense to sneak in damage. Oh, so it curves around a shield. Okay. Does it require anything? It requires 14 dex and 9 strength. Okay. Something to try out at some point. Hmm. Bar humbug. You might want to cut like a hole in your mouthpiece so I can hear hear you a bit better. I've got this. I've got this. Whoa, okay, that was closer than I hoped. Let's go. Boss or no boss? Um, what did I just- what did I just see in front of my eyes, then? Dude. My one-handed attacks are getting so high damage now. I don't even need a two-hand.
Oh, is this what's... Is this whatever is refreshing the balls? I think it is. Hmm, right, we've got a trap little thing there, I see that. Ah, right, it's that, okay. I see... Can I back- you can't go back- walk backwards, can you? <laughs> I want to raise my shield and go backwards, so I'm shielding myself from that. Um... Hey, that works. Uh, that did not work. I got hit. <laughs> it almost worked. I'm trying to look upwards. Jesus Christ. Whoa. Uh, it's worth it. 16 flasks remaining. Oh, do I go up or down? That's the point. I can jump off to get that loot whenever I choose to. Oh god, oh god, no! No! Oh god. Shit! That's even worse! Oh my god. No! <laughs> Fuck! Fuck! And here I thought I was gonna get a perfect sense fortress run. Oh, for fuck's sake. What a piece of shit I am. What a basic stupid mistake. If I'd have just got hit and then kept running. In my defense, there's a big, long delay when you get up from being knocked down before you can start running again. So that wasn't entirely my fault. Um, let's just kill everything again. Fuck it. Oh, my poise there didn't knock me. You see that? Jesus. Jesus Christ, okay. I think that 40 poise is working wonders. I got two swings off there whilst I was getting hit and I wasn't being stumbled. That's a game changer. I mean, I'm taking damage, but it's still a game changer. Well, let's not get careless. Maybe I can do this without two deaths, you know? Oh. How the fuck do you get that? Let's go. I can't believe I died in such a bullshit way. I'm actually ashamed. You never saw that death, that didn't happen. <sighs> Jesus. Oh, it's all gravy. Ball? I, I reckon I can reach the top room. It's, it's a long run up, but I want to go up first before I go down. Where's the ball? Oh, did I, did I do something? Let's talk to him again. I think I might have done something which redirects where the ball is going, you know? So it's now safe to go this way, I guess. Let's go speak to him again. He might move on or something. Okay, maybe not. Maybe I've got to redirect it further or stop it completely. I'm, I'm proud of my performance so far, not counting being, like, double squished by the boulder. Now, 
Now, yeah, me healing to full was definitely a smart decision. I can survive one flattening, but, I, but like, not two. Um, I'm sorry, I'm gonna waste a flask, get to full. It's such a big deal. Okay. I also- I'm, I'm gonna get my runes and then reset. I'm just gonna try my best to get up here now. Bullshit. Right, I've learned the hard way. You can't even touch the backside of it, even if it's rolling away from you. I'm just gonna run straight in, no matter what, no matter what. Fucking hell! <laughs> How fucking close was that? Ah, right, I see it's got a little pinball pusher thing. <laughs> That's cool. That's like a giant is uh, using a pinball machine, like holding and releasing the little thing. That's cool. Right, I've got a trap over there. Oh, I wonder if I can... Yes, there's another pusher thing on the wall there. Another one there. And another one there. Right, I can change direction of this. By moving this. Right, okay. Am I... Right, no. Ooh, ooh. Hmm... Right, I'm going to turn the sound on in my ear, so I can think. Am I right here in thinking if I turn this so it comes this way, that will destroy the bridge and stop me ever being able to get that item there? That sound, that looks about right to me. I bet this destroys the bridge. It, either completely, or it'll just damage it and make it more dangerous. So how do I get to that? There's a bridge up there. Bridge up there, I reckon you'll, it'll go down there and go to there. And then there's nothing there, maybe an illusory wall. I, I'm praying that I'm right. And I get this item, and then I destroy it. Because that will make me feel smart. Let's go over here. Now, what the hell is this going to do? Oh, right, okay. I see. The, the platform hasn't come back up. Oh, right, okay, that's a one-time thing. Oh, cool. Maybe this isn't the way to get to that sky bridge. I will come back, but I don't want to turn that thing and destroy that bridge. I can always run back. It's no problem. One, two, three, hang on, fucking hell, how close are these? I think I've got to get past all four at once. One, two, fucking hell, there's no time at all. One. Oh, I guess there is. Panic over. I got one snake boy, two snake boys. Okay, it's fine. Let's get them together on the same side. Ow. I haven't finished him. All right, heal. Jesus Christ. I appreciate the snakey boy's design, but I don't appreciate their snakiness. You know, are these actually different snakes? They've got cobra heads and the other ones had like regular snake heads? They are different, okay. Oh shit. Right, these are the magic ones. I'm guessing cobra boys are the spell and, and poison ones. And then the regular snake are the warrior snakes. <laughs> <laughs> okay. 
We've got warrior snakes and spellcaster snakes. We've got the snakes and then the snakes. Okay. Well, I might as well get this shit. Come at me, um... See, this is a warrior snake. It's not a cobra. Okay. Yes! 650! Oh, God. Right. I need to get back into your parry gameplay because, damn. That's some serious damage. Large shard times two. Nice. I'm, I'm much, much... Get off me. I am much more preferring this place to the catacombs, let me tell you. Do you see the difference? You've, both places have traps and, like, cool enemies. But the catacombs is just a heroic ball lake. This is just fun. This is true Indiana Jones fun type of, like, traps and enemies. Fuck the catacombs. Um. Hang on, let me just quickly look down here. I do want to be going up to, to a sky bridge, you know? I think that might be an elevator shaft. Hmm. Well, so far I'm a big fan. I took him around. I'm not complaining and saying it's a shit part of the game. Don't get me wrong. It's uh, it's on the f if the catacombs feels like a rite of passage sort of a. Hello. It, yeah, it feels like a rite of passage moment of the game, but. This is just aesthetically cooler than the catacombs. Um. Well, I've got long range attacks as well, motherfucker. Mine wins, bitch. You know, I'm so glad I went into. Okay, we've got more loot down there. Hang on there. Uh... Oh, fuck it. All in good time. I'm so glad I went into pyromancy. It's just that little... Little... Kiss. Little hint of long range that, that completes a melee build, in my opinion. Where the fuck is this going? <laughs> this is so cool looking. Alright, we've got one and two. I reckon there's a gap between two and three there. Be prepared for snaky action. Any more snaky actions? Uh, we've got two trap things. Can I stand on the edge? I don't even need to stand on the edge. Okay, here we go. These mannequins are scaring the shit out of me, by the way. Just thought I'd throw that out there. Um... Okay, there's literally no point coming this way. There's that elevator thing again. There must... I must enable some elevator function at some point, maybe at the top of here. Hang on, calm down, calm down, camera. There's another one to walk past, there we go. Okay. Now, before we do whatever the fuck this is, let me just make sure all systems are good to go. Um, yeah. Let's do this. Boss or just fucking what? Boss. Hello, boss. Is he going to be tossing shit at me? That's a yes. That's what that is. Over here. Toss this one. Over this way. Does he have no face? Oh, he's not tossing. Oh, is he, uh... Is he what's dropping the, the balls? Can I go back? Oh, I can. Right. I just want to say... That thing I could turn to move the direction of the balls. If killing this guy stops that, then I don't want to do this first, because I reckon sending the balls in different directions might be a good thing. I just wanted to see if I can get to that item on the bridge first. Um, I hope it doesn't toss them at me. Dude. 
Yeah. Ah, oh, it's just magic. What the fuck is tossing shit? Is that those balls but just being tossed so ferociously that they're exploding? Hello. Oh, that's a problem. By the time the fire goes out, he's tossing another one. I mean, you should talk about fucking tough timing. Jesus. Oops. Oops. Oh, fucking hell, man. Jesus. Right, hang on just one second. What's that gap there? Is that where the bridge is? Toss it here, that's a good thing. Oh, there's a campfire. Yeah, I've got to get it. I've got to. It's too important not to. <laughs> Ooh, okay. I might want to level up with these runes so I've got nothing to lose, and I might want to, uh... Use a, cu a couple more humanity and kindle this fire. Um, I've been talking a big uh, stamina game. How about I actually put a point in stamina? There we go. There we go. Well, I've got nothing to lose. Uh, until I start, until I die again, and I, and my flask. I've still got fifteen flasks. Then I don't need to kindle it for now. Um. I will try to remember to go human before- if there's a big white, like, clearly a boss door later on at the end of Sense Fortress, I'll try and go human before that, just in case there's an invader before the boss in this area. Um, I'll try to remember. Right, where are we? That was the white fog door, wasn't it? Right, I see where we are. Okay. Well, let's go back out and keep climbing up, uh, I guess. Or down. If I can just get that item on that bridge, I'll probably go back, honestly. And just try and... Try sending those balls in different directions. Hello, it's one of these fuckers again. Long time no see. How's it going? I need him to come up here. Come up here. Say goodbye to your life, sir. I don't even have that critical ring on either, which boosts the damage of these. How much damage would I do with that on? Jesus. Where the hell is this going? I'm uneasy right now. <laughs> Can you blame me at this point? Oh. I love walking around them, it makes the backstab so easy. Cool, just an optional direction. That's what I like to see. Flame stone plate ring. Is that like a fire protection? Dude, for the longest time I had like no rings in this game. Now I'm getting so many. Boosts fire defense. Stone plates, the symbol of a true knight. Grant the strength to face various hardships. The red stone plate. I'm guessing you've got like a blue stone plate and like a, you know, shit like that. A yellow stone plate. But this one is fire. I'd have loved that when I went to the demon fucking ruins, let me tell you. Um, in fact, I bet that's one of the rings people online probably suggest you equip to, to get those awkward bits of loot in the lava that I somehow managed to get. Okay. Well, if there's any particular fiery places... Um, hang on, what's that bit of loot there? 
Uh, I'll tell you what, I'm actually going to quickly take the poise ring off and put the fire one on because they are tossing fire barrels now. I've already been hit by fire once. And speaking of, I bet the fire shield I've got on, uh, 85, that one. Let's put the fire shield on. Is that it? Sorry. Uh, dragon, right, dragon is fire. Okay. I wonder if having that raise actually helps or not. I bet now I can take way more fire damage. Hang on, hang on, sorry. How do I get to that loot? Uh... There's that bridge I want to get to, if you noticed. That's that's where it is. Um. Hang on, how the fuck do you get to this? There is no way to this loot body there. There's no door underneath me. That's not a way up, that's a way down. I wonder if I've got to get to that guy and jump off later. Whoa. I probably do. Let's climb up. Ow. Fuck off. Let's keep going. Well, I'm getting somewhere now. Where's he going to toss that? I'm kind of worried here. Is he tossing that at the bridge? Yes, he is. Right, no problem. Right, that's... Okay, this is a... Uh, ow. This is a fucking dangerous place. I'm trying to do the maths here. Where is the bridge that I'm trying to get to? The, the sky bridge that leads to the lower bridge. There's the sky bridge I want. Oh, but it's not actually going anywhere. Oh, I thought that was going in there so I can go down there. I wonder if that's an illusory wall there on the end of that bridge. Let's keep going. Dude! Dude! Oh, it's one of these fuckers. Uh, Havel was the last one of these guys. Guys that I saw. If I remember right, their overhead strike... Uh... Goes past my shield. Um... You know, I've just remembered, I got the Havel ring off one of these guys in the Darkroot base Basin. But didn't I first see one of these guys in the church? Ow. No, no, I'm, I'm, I'm trying to roll, I'm trying to roll, I'm trying to roll. Fucking hell, man. Oh god, oh god. Oh god, this is just dangerous, man. Oh, fuck off, man, every single time. <laughs> right, die. Dude, that is one powerful shield he's using. Okay, you can't kick his shield away, it's too big. That's hilarious. Right, I can't get past that fucking defense of his. There you go, bitch. No cool ring for me, that's fine. Dude, what a beautiful sort of horizon. Fuck it out! Is this... This isn't just Sen's fortress, is it? This entire castle. We've been seeing glimpses of this castle from everywhere, but... Um... Or is this just the greater region that is, um... Not New Londo, because that's the ghost town. What, what's the place that they've been calling this, this whole place? Uh... Old Londo? <laughs> Londo Calrissian? Very cool. Dude. Oh, hang on, hang, hang on. I'll I recognize that rooftop over there if it's the last rooftop I'll ever see. That's the fucking duo gargoyle roof, and that's the bell. I recognize where I am. 
Yeah! Those two little turrets on that roof, the left one is the doorway that goes in and down. And that's where Rhea, the priestess, like down below that roof, she's praying in there. Andre's down there to the left. In fact, I believe that little roof above my head there, that's the roof above Andre. That's his tower, I think. Uh, it must be. Because down there and out the left is those three undead on the way to Andre. Yeah. And I reckon that direction is the front gate that you enter Sense Fortress in down below. Very cool. Oh, yes. Me likey likey. Um, my biggest, right, my biggest worry here is that I'm going to walk straight into a, the main boss without even fucking knowing it. And then I'll, then I'll lose my chance to do the invasion because I'm not human right now. Um... I am tempted to go hu human again. It costs one humanity. Two if I want to kindle that motherfucker. Um, I can see gargoyles up there, Jesus Christ. So I want to go human before the end of Sen's Fortress, and I also... Uh, I want to redirect those balls before I kill the ball throwers. But I guess we'll see. This is one of those games that, that you, you can so easily regret everything. <laughs> I mean, fantastic parry, my friend, but go fuck yourself. That was the worst time parry I've ever seen. Just have some swings. Fuck you. I'm glad his parry uh, uh, riposte wasn't enough to kill me. Jesus. Rykard? Rykard? Richard's rapier? Rykard's rapier? Is this like distant cousin to Rykard? <laughs> uh, oh, fuck me. Where is it? Scales B dexterity. So this is a fast motherfucker. A rapier with intricate decorations. Chosen weapon of the infamous undead prince R Rikard. I'm choosing to pronounce it. Rikard's exploits are told in Monomyth. He was born into royalty but wandered the lands on a fateful, ill-conceived journey. He became undead and disappeared up north. Is this him? Just some shitty little soldier. What an unceremonial end. Is this just loot? Okay, divine blessing. Oh, that's what Priestess was selling. The full heal, full awesome flask. Um, rare ring of sacrifice. So coming up here was entirely optional. That's what I like to hear. Now what's that? Rare ring of sacrifice. Die, die, lose nothing, nullify curse, ring breaks. Ah, oh, so it's like a even tougher version of that. Uh item that I've got. Nullify Curse. This mysterious ring was created in a sacrificial rite of Velka. Isn't that a character in Assassin's Creed? Uh, the Goddess of Sin. The magenta shaded ring, ring is especially rare. Its wearer will lose nothing upon death and will be freed from any curse whatsoever. But the ring itself breaks. Am I freed from the curse when I die? Because all the other shit is to do with when I die. Uh, hmm. I'll remember that I've got that. I'd be lying if I said I wasn't concerned that it gives me that now. Is that trying to hint to me that I might want to put it on because I'm about to lose some shit irreversibly? <laughs> <sighs> right, so this is a dead end up here. Okay. Is this? I'm trying to figure out if any of this is actually reachable. Because this is just a one-way track, you know what I mean? But that doesn't look too far down. 
kind of. Alright, okay. Oh, hang on, that looks... That looks very important to me, does that? Oh, Jesus, there's even more castle above us, man! This is one big fortress. Fuck. Jesus. Let me know in the comments if this is all, all everything we see, all this castle place is actually one place. I mean, it clearly kind of is, but it's very big. On top of the mountains, right at the bottom of the mountains. This makes that royal capital of Elden Ring look tiny in comparison. Hmm, well, let's go back down. I appreciate the view, but uh, I've got places I need to be. I'm, I'm a sweaty Betty today. It's warm here today. It's starting to become summer again, and I don't like it. <laughs> Fuck summer. You know you're a true gamer when you hate the summer and warmth and everyone else likes it. Whoa, that's it. Fuck off, fuck off, fuck. You know, I'm gonna heal. I, I, I... I ain't gonna risk it. I can toss... I mean, technically, I can jump down there if I tried. But something tells me I would die trying. Um... Well, hang on a second. Right, that's not connected to this place behind me. I can go down here. Any reason to drop down there? Uh... Right, if I drop down there, am I just fucked? Oh, no, I can jump down there. Uh, I'm trying to figure out if there's anything down there. I don't think there is. Um, that door is looking... Admit it. Admit it. That wall there is looking a bit suspicious. Let's try. Right, okay. No. <laughs> it did look suspicious. Look at him just eyeing me up. Oh right, this is a way out of there, okay. Hmm, I'm getting mixed signals from this place. Go, 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 go. Go, 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 go. Hey, hey, hey. Go, go. I've got 11 flasks, that's fine for me, right now. Let's go. You know what, this is actually going, like, the wrong direction I wanted to go. Uh. Why is he so delayed now? Over here, that's right, toss it over here. Okay. Oh god, oh my god, can I run and jump to that? I do believe that's the very sky bridge I was looking at before. Oh god, help me. Um, let's go over here. Oh my god, this might be the biggest moment of my life. Can I make that jump? I've only got 7,000 runes. The bonfire is right beneath me, it's not even a big deal. I'm not human. That's the, that's the silver lining of having lost my humanity. Oh. My anus is clenched. Clenched, I tell you. Oh my god. Oh shit, hello. Jesus, hello. I'm glad you're friendly. Ah, uh, what? What, who, who are you? Undead, eh? It's a bit quiet, isn't he? I took on Sam's fortress alone, but I'm no different from those vile creatures. 
I was driven by conceit. Ah, you think you're different. Why are the voices? Yes, I, I remember that feeling. For I was the same. Ah, <gasps> 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 oh, I didn't mean to do that. What? I'm sorry. No! Fuck. Can I... Can I... Can I... Oh my god, is he always going to be pissed off at me? That's the first time I've, I've misclicked. Oh my god. Oh, he sounded so friendly as well. I, is it just over now? No matter if I die, reload, nothing. Is he just going to be... Oh my god. Oh god. I deserve to die, honestly. I'm sorry. I- I'm sorry. I'm sorry- oh for fuck's sake! I don't even get anything either. I don't even get any loot. I'm sorry, please- It- it- you know what? It, it's a blind playthrough. Anything can happen. Anything goes. This is my blind experience. I killed him accidentally. It is what it is. But he sounded f like- honestly, he sounded friendlier than just about every other NPC so far. I'm actually gutted that he's the one that I accidentally hit. Um... Mo oh god, oh god. Okay, the, the worst that could happen is he was a shop that could sell me stuff and a summon for the upcoming boss fight. I'm hoping he wasn't a covenant in and of himself, you know? But it could be worse. But feel free to let me know in the comments if that is a major fuck up just there. Like I've I've lost access to a chunk of the game or some shit like that. It is what it is and it will be what it will be. But Jesus, that's going to suck if that's a real issue. I want to point something out to you. The reason I did that. Well, it's because I'm a, I'm a complete fuckwit is the reason. That's the real reason. <laughs> but the sensitivity of these trigger switches on your PlayStation controller are so fucking sensitive. Yeah, yeah. I accidentally swing quite a lot, just not into a friendly NPC. But I'll show you how light you've got to tap these for it to register a, a touch. Um, I mean, you, you can see... By the button there, you've got to it, it presses right down. So it's got quite a range of motion that button, but look how light. That that's not even one millimeter being pressed down. The lightest touch. Oh, you can sort of you can hear the I'm not pressing that in at all. That's, that's literally not one millimeter of pressing it down. The lightest touch does that. I'm not even touching that. The, the light... Do you see how easy it is to accidentally do a heavy attack? That's, um... That's my excuse. Like, because I want to point out that by default my fingers rest on those keys, not L1 and R1. My fingers rest naturally lower down on those triggers, so that's why I did that there. Jesus. I've done a few accidental power attacks in this game, but that's the first time it actually cost me greatly. I'm gutted, but it is what it is. F fuck it. F fuck it. Put the magic shield back on. Fuck you, I'm in no mood for you. You snaky bastard. Right. Cage key, right. Oh god, is that... I'm hoping that's not part of a quest that that guy would have given me. Why did it have to be that guy? He's the first person that's actually spoken to me with any level of friendliness. I think there was a guy down in the un Undead Burg that I released that was kind of friendly as well, but most other people are sort of dicks. Like that guy who's been at Filing Shrine the whole time, who left for some reason, wasn't really friendly. He told me what to do, but he wasn't friendly. Onion Head is just a mystery. The the big round jolly guy is just a devout sort of guy who's not really friendly. The first proper friendly guy I've met, I accidentally fucking stab him in the chest. Like a complete piece of shit. 
Why did it have to be him? Are they all fuckers? Um. Key. Key. Right. Cage key. Opens hanging cage in Sen's fortress. If a hapless adventurer becomes fatigued during an imprudent attempt to overcome the fortress, the serpent men will not kill him, but lock him up in a lonely cage. Eventually, unless they have forgotten, they drag the victim off to who knows where. Um. This sounds very optional to me. It, this sounds like side quest, which sounds like that guy would have had something to do with it. Um. Okay, but these snaky fucks so far, every last one of them has just tried to kill me. They haven't tried to imprison me. Interesting. Very interesting. Me. Um, I wonder if you can intentionally uh, kind of like getting in that coffin to get transported somewhere else. What the fuck is shooting? Oh, right. Ah, right, okay. I wonder if you can intentionally get captured by the serpent people. I'm actually properly gutted about that, for real. I just, I'm trying to convince myself that it's not that bad. Hey, it fucking is bad, isn't it? Hey, it fucking is bad. Even as I killed him, he just said, help me. Like, he was the, he was the best person in this game. And I just went and killed him. I'm not going to attack you when you're trying to... That's right, bitch. Fuck you. Oh, God. I wonder if you do, like, side quests, even when one of the NPCs involved is dead. I mean, probably not, but... I wonder if this is one of those cages that that cage... Uh, that the key is mentioned. And unlocking it... F fall... F falls you down there. <laughs> into the abyss. Hmm. Ooh. Can I, uh, is there a prompt out of interest? There is. Okay. There sort of might be counterweights for something else that I don't even know. I can unlock this one here. Well, I've used the key. Um. Okay, I've got footsteps, big footsteps moving. Um. Okay. Oh god, I'm not gonna... I can always return later when I've got less to lose and see if I can walk into that cage. Um, although it, it does say... That description says... Um, and they drag you off to who knows where. I wonder if that t does actually take you somewhere. Like, maybe it takes you all the way down. Right to the bottom. Um... I'm going to go up before I go try that out, but actually, that sounds about right to me. Oh, God. Right, he's going to toss something there, isn't he? Ow. Fucking hell! I can't see, I can't see, I can't see, I can't see, I can't see. Oh, my God. Oh, fucking hell. Oh, fuck. The love of God. <laughs> Right, throw into the trash any notion that I was actually going to do Sense Fortress like a professional. I'm just an absolute piece of shit. I'm a noob scrub with no skill. <laughs> it's just... Oh, God. Right, if I wanted to, I could go and redirect the balls now. And I am tempted. Maybe if I if I can redirect the balls, I can get Onion Head to, to come further into Sense Fortress with me. So let's go do that. Fuck the 9,000 runes. I don't give a fuck. I don't care anymore. Oh, God. Run, 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 run. What's up, dude? 
What the fuck? What the fuck, man? I mean... What the fuck? Fuck! Fuck! Jesus! Oh, Jesus Christ, what a- What a fail! What a fail! Fuck you. Fuck you. Okay, so these motherfuckers can munch on you. Got it. I am munch material. I fucking got it. I can jump down there. Fuck it, fuck it, fuck it. I've got nothing to lose anymore. I am just this game's bitch. Oh, we did see that loot and shit out here, okay. Okay. Why not use this as an opportunity to get some loot? And roll up some walls. <laughs> I know it's like incredibly unmodest and like shows a great deal of hubris, but I actually genuinely came into this place thinking, you know what? I bet I surprise everyone with how good I um, perform in this sense fortress, house of traps. And then I go and just spoil it all by saying something stupid like, I'm professional. Right, there's the old fucker. Hang on, where's that loot down there? Right, so that's with the Titanite Demon down there, that's fine. Um, oh, 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 fucking hell, is there something wrong with me? Christ. Okay. Let's read that ring that I just got. I just wanted to, like, double-check I was where I thought I was. Yes. Okay. See, there's loot in various places in here. Right, okay. I don't think there's anywhere else. Like, I can jump down, but that that's the original way in here. So this might be a shortcut out of here, back to Andre and shit. I guess. I'll, uh... I'll keep it in mind, but for now, let's go back up. Uh... Never mind. <laughs> I forgot that I fell here. Okay. Yet another example of me being a professional. Fuckwit. Um... I wonder if you can basically fall your way down legitimately here. You, you can fall onto all your platforms. Uh, oh, well, actually, no, you can't. Because you got spikes everywhere. Let's run back to the beginning, then. Oh, God. Oh, God. How did that not hit me? Fucking hell! He's here! Oh, for for the love of God. That's right. That's what happens to you, you snaky shit. Whew. Okay, Jesus Christ. Oh. I'm gonna heal for... No, I'm definitely gonna heal. <laughs> right, well, perfect topic. I mean, actually, you know what? Straight up, that actually saved me time. Getting back up here. I wanted to come back up here anyway. Um, roughly. I need to go back a little bit, but... Alright. I say I saved some time. <laughs> Let's use this as a chance to read that ring that I just got. Yet another fucking ring. Slumbering Dragon Crest, where it produces no sound whatsoever. So that I'm guessing that means I can sprint up to people to do the backstab rather than sneak up. It was worn by a certain surreptitious sorcerer in Vinheim Dragon School. The ring is engraved with an everlasting dragon in silent slumber. Okay, gotcha. Um, okay, nice to know. Nice to know. Uh. Oh, 
Oh my god, just, 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 just fuck off. Right. Um, oh, once you press it down, it's done forever. That's interesting. Let's press this one down. Okay, so now they're both pressed down. Oh, no, that one's come back up again. Okay. Um, I do need to go back, though, to get to that ball place. My zero. Right, let's kill that fucking thing. Two-handed. I'm gonna. I'm gonna rip this guy a new one. Fuck you. Okay. Jesus Christ. <laughs> All right. Don't step on the fuckers. One, two, right. There's a gap after the second. Okay. Let's go back to basics. All right. That's a good plan. Go back to basics. Let's not run off the edge. Let's not get hit by axes. Um, I'm actually legit surprised that getting hit by those isn't an instant death. I figured it would be. Right, don't munch on my head. Just die. Right, where am I going and what am I doing? We can go back there. Uh, I'll jump down there. I didn't realize it had been this long. Since I'd seen that ball mechanism. Should be right through... Uh, honestly, couldn't tell you. Right through here. Here it is. Okay, right. For, for the love of God. I finally got the item. Where are the other pathways going? Right, this is the one that was originally fucking the dude. It's funny, it's like, when I progressed a bit further, it's like somebody else moved this, so, and that stopped it coming down here towards Onion Head, who's still sitting down there. So that's one direction. That, I wanted to go that direction, because that's like the useless direction, basically. And that is, um... There was that. Oh, I can go down there. Well, I'll tell you what. Let's push it and see what happens. Oh, right. Okay. Officially, it's going down there now. I think. It is. Now, is it not? Right. It's not destroying the bridge. Okay. But now I can go both this way and that way. Let's go this way. Fuck it. Uh. Does not open from this side. Okay. What else have we got? Hmm. Elevator, I've been hearing this whole time, I think. Right, that takes us down, and I'm guessing that'll take us to the other side of the locked door on that side. So before I go down, that's just hooking up with the earlier place, that's fine. Let's go back down the other stairs, because there was some loot I wanted, now that it's safe to do so. That's where I want to be. Oh, Jesus. Oh, there's actually a fucker there as well. Right, can I use this as a chance to try my falling down attack? Oh, I did. Nice. 
cool. This is a maze, Jesus. The camera is not my friend in this fucking place. Oh, that's the same room that I was in. That's the very same room I jumped down from, uh... Up, up there, I think right in front of my head, that's where I jumped down originally, it just goes to the same place. Okay. Well, let's commit to a direction for now. Um... Interesting looking place. Hello! We've got a big old hole with a ladder. That goes absolutely fucking nowhere? Hmm. Huh. Shield up. Check for traps. Let's, uh... Oh, is this the, uh, the same room that... No. Okay, fuck it. Open it. It's a trap! It's a trap! I'm getting eaten by a chest in the face! I've been face munched in the face! Ch chest munched, face munched, chest face dead. <laughs> I've been waiting for the first chest in this game to, to kill me, or trap me, or t teleport me. There it is, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Fucking eaten by a chest. Fuck off. Alright, is that fucker there again? Let's kill him again, fuck it. Just gotta kill a couple. I wonder if you can actually make, if you can sprint and jump onto there safely. Hmm, right, okay. I wonder if that same th monster is inside the chest. Um. Every time you open it is what I'm saying. Oh, come on. Motherfucking snake, man. Oh, I oh, didn't mean to do that. Oh, <laughs> okay. Let's just pretend I've only got five flasks and I didn't waste two. It's all good. It's all good. I need to pretend in my own head hit here that I'm doing a good job. Shall I go back to Onion Face right now and see if I can uh, talk to him now that officially the boulder is is safe forever? Let's do it. Maybe he's got something new for me to say. What the fuck? Why is the boulder suddenly back here? Oh my god. Right, come at me. I don't even give a fuck. Bring it on. Why? Okay, there's some magic being up there that is moving the, the switch machine. Do I have to get past this thing again? Like, really? Yes, I do. Are you kidding me? Oh, this is gonna be fucking close. This is gonna be close as shit, man. Oh, it is. It is if I'm a fucking complete. Stand up now, you slow shit. My god, okay, fucking hell. Who moved this? Is it because I died, officially? Now, it should be safe now. So let's go back down there, whilst... Uh... Oh, he has moved. Look, he's moved. I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing, honest to God. Um... Okay. Okay. That's, that's probably a good thing. It means... 
he's progressing through the dungeon just like I am. Um, I wonder if, what direction. Are you? Are you? Are you? Are you? Sh are you? Are you? Shitting me? Are, are you shitting me? Why is this thing moving? What what fucking apparition in this motherfucker is moving this lever? I'm being trolled by a fucking ghost who can push handles and levers and shit. Oh my god. Oh my god. Right, is this... If I just get too far away, is that what fucks it? Like, I want to know specifically what triggers the changing of this when I'm not here. Well, all I know is Onion Head's not there. It, the ball is currently in a safe direction. I can go down there if I want to, or down there. Let's go this way first. Let's commit. No, wrong way. Uh, oh, is it, sorry, no, it's, it's the other way I wanted to go first. <laughs> Fuck me. Got levers. I mean, that's not my fault. Shit's just changing. Oh, Jesus. I need you to just drop dead if you'd be so kind. Yes. Get flattened, you snaky fuck. That's it. Fall into the hole. That's not the way I want to go. That's fine. Uh, let's keep going down. Don't, don't mistake my uh, absolute exasperation at my own lack of skill at not enjoying this. I'm thoroughly enjoying this. This is my shit right here. Why is there a ball in this hole that was no... Oh, God. What is going on here? Like... Like, wh what the fuck? Why is that machine back up there changing positions by itself? Onion Head's now gone. There was nothing in this hole, now there's a boulder so we can walk over here. I, that hasn't escaped my notice. This is clearly a mechanism that allows me to walk over there. But why wasn't that, that that's like three points. Point number four, why wasn't this here the last time I came down here? Because I, I have switched that boulder thing up there to the same place that it was in when I came here last, but now there's a boulder here and there wasn't before. Mul okay. <laughs> you, see, you see what I'm trying to say here? Like, what? What is going on? Um. Oh, oh, right, okay, it's just it's straight up a monster. Okay, this is one tall motherfucker. Oh my god, what a horrific being. Right, lunge at me if you can, thank you. He's laughing at me. Well, now who's laughing, bitch? You lanky streak of piss. Lightning spear, okay. Oh. Oh. Is that already upgraded to, to lightning? Like the equivalent of using a lightning ember to upgrade a weapon? Because if so, that's pretty cool. Uh, that means I've got a weapon to use against those fucking dragons. It is, it's got a lightning symbol on it. Cool. Okay, so you can just straight up loot weapons in this game that are already upgraded. That's fantastic. So I've, I've got a weapon I can use. Um, it scales with strength and dex. That's kind of perfect. It does lightning damage, of course. It's nice and light. Thrust. You know what? Let's just quickly throw that on. I don't believe I've used a spear yet in this game. Oh, is that nice? I imagine this being faster than the halberd. Oh, it's exactly... The, the pokey boy is exactly the same as the halberd. That's fantastic. Um, in fact, that pokey boyness is exactly the same as the halberd. That's my main attraction to the halberd, by the way. So that's fantastic. Um, but the big strength of the halberd is the power attack is a gigantic swipe. What is the power attack with this? Oh, it's a thrust. That's better against the boars. Of which I've only seen one in the game. Um, two-handed? 
Still a thrust. Still a pokey boy. Uh, what's the running attack? Oh, that's... Oh, a running thrust is fantastic, actually. And it's nice and fast as well. Two-handed run. Still a thrust. Right, it's only thrust. I see. Um, even the jump attack is a thrust. Gotcha. That's nice. I'll, uh, I'll switch it off, but I really like that. What am I doing? As I said, I wanted one of every type of special weapon in this game, you know, a lightning weapon, a flame weapon, etc. I think that's pretty much saved me from needing to upgrade a weapon to lightning, because I'm happy with that move set. Um, in fact, that's ra that's really good because when you think about dragons, they're quite big. You sort of they've always got some distance on you, so long range pokiness is probably a really good thing against dragons specifically. Fuck is my sword. <laughs> um, I'd be more than happy to upgrade that lightning, that that basic lightning spear, rather than do something else, lightning instead. Again, though, let me know if there's any other weapons uh, suggestions you've got. This goes up and down, so I should be safe going up here. Yeah? Shield up, Jesus Christ. Right, what's up here? Oh, it goes in further. Let's go up even further and see what's up top, shall we? Oh! 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 Spikes in the face! Spikes in the face! We've got spikes in the face, okay. Okay, we've got spikes in the face. How was that not an instant kill? Jesus Christ. I've got one flask left. Let's, uh... This is probably just a way up, but I want to see what's down here anyway. All right. Okay. Okay. Um... Right. Did I... Did I solve this little puzzle here purely by accident? Because clearly you need multiple ball, balls to roll down here to fill this up so you can walk across here. Y you feel me? Now, that's at least two, maybe three balls minimum. Yeah, maybe four or five, actually, because that was quite a tall hole in the floor. Uh, hmm. Yeah. Although I don't know how these got here, because I never intentionally sent them this direction. I always sent them off the ledge, you know? Interesting. Covert has got another one. Jesus Christ. Lots of ring action today. I can take that off for now. I don't need fire protection right now. Ooh. Ooh. Covert has gold serpent ring boosts item discovery. Fuck yes. Why not? Um, Does that include humanity items? That's probably irrelevant, because that's only rats and, like, dogs and shit. Gluttony, Golden Ring, boosts its item discovery. Well, my fire protection is irrelevant right now. Um, I could put my poise ring back on, that would definitely help, but actually... Fuck it. <laughs> Just give me more item discovery. How much has it given me? Three, three hundred! Fucking hell! Right, the default with no... Not being human and no soft humanity is one, is, yeah, one hundred. I think if I remember right, that goes to one fifty with a single soft humanity. Isn't that correct? So it's, that must mean it's fifty extra item discovery per soft humanity. And that ring takes me straight to 300. So that ring is the equivalent of uh, one, two, three, four humanity, isn't it? Am I right there? So throwing that on is the same as having four soft humanity. That's fantastic. By the way, I'm nervous that a ball is just going to come flying through a ceiling. This is... I don't like the look of this. Not one bit.
Um, forgive my trepidation, but leaping into a gigantic pit is not my idea of a good day. Do I have a pri- I don't have any more prism stones, do I? Shit. I'd have tossed one down here if I had one. Fuck. Um, well, that's just death, surely. Can we agree? What sort of fuckwit would jump down at here? Doesn't even light up. No, fuck that. Uh, let's put magic back on. Right, well, I can always come... Uh... Uh, this is I'm starting to trip out here. Wh which way is uphill and which way is downhill? That's weird. I can always come down then jump into the pit if there's nothing else to do. Um. Oh, you know what? Huh. Do you reckon the bolt I can fill up whatever the fuck is down there with boulders? Hmm. I bet I can, you know. If you can fill up that little hole there, why can't you fill up further holes? That's what she said. Let's do this. Please don't have a ball in my face right now. Say it ain't so. Okay, let's do it. Um, right, which ones are going to be now? Is that back the original direction? That's not right. Keep going. That's uh, down the middle there, isn't it? And again. I'll send like a good three or four that direction, I reckon. Let's just chill for a minute. In fact, you know what I'm going to do? Uh... Since there's no enemies that can attack me here and I'm safe, I'm actually going to go grab a drink. I'm going to take like a five minute break, just standing here, uh, as you do. Um, and I'm just going to let the balls flow. So yeah, I'll jump cut forward. Right, I'm back again and I've been recording for over three hours, so... I might have a little bit of shit to edit out, maybe ten minutes worth of looking for that blacksmith, but uh... Otherwise, I've got like an hour left for this episode, so I really want to make some progress and stop dying. Um, I've actually just been on YouTube releasing an episode of something else, so um, actually I've been stood here for like 15 minutes. So that must be enough balls in the hole, if that's even a thing. So for now, let's go back down there and see if I have actually filled said hole. <laughs> Please say I've done something right. <laughs> I will forever, forever, and I'm talking after I've finished playing this game, in many years into the future, I will regret um, accidentally killing that poor guy. Right, has anything changed or happened? No, okay. I thought that might actually be a thing. Hmm, okay. I wonder if it is a thing. Either way, we're done down here, so let's, uh... Let's go half a floor up, and then we'll go th down. Like, where that those cage doors were. Ooh, I love this game. Any game that has this sort of visceral feel when you fail <laughs> is fantastic. Am I right or am I right? Uh, oh no, hang on, sorry. Right, I think I see, you, you can't. Um, right, yeah. When I saw these earlier, I think I mentally equated the back side of this cage door with going down here first, but it's not. It's that th that's not a thing. Um, um. Hmm. Where else have we got to go, other than somehow down to uh, that Titanite demon and down into the main pit of this place? You know. 
Oh. Oh, hang on a second. Now, this is the one of the original places to put the balls. It's funny. Did, did I do that hole in the wall there? Because that hole in the final wall behind that snake fuck wasn't there before. The snake I was just standing against a wall. But in turning this, did I do that? Because I'm sure a couple of balls came down this direction earlier, you know? And wouldn't that have done the same thing? I, uh, I guess not. You've got another cage there, which is kind of... Mm. Uh. Hmm. And I can still cage myself at the top, by the way. Where you can climb in the cage. Ow. Ow. Oh, God. Right, last flask. Um. Is this a cage I can get in? No, okay. Okay. You've got other cages you can use. Let's just open them all. Why not? So it's forever done. Ooh, can I release a dude? Hello! Now before I do, let's just, uh... Before I do, let's loot this. <laughs> As you do. Oh god, come on. Soul of a hero. Right, let's talk. Hello, witch person. Hmm. You seem quite lucid. Hello. A rare thing in these times. I am Logan. I'm a bit cooped up, as you can see. I have a bright idea. Suppose you set me free. I'm old and empty handed, but I could really oh, okay. age and sorcery. Why not? This place is melting my mind. The inactivity is repressive. Well, I've already killed one guy today. I shall let this one live. If he sells me uh, some magic, that's great. Oh, heavens. Thank you. I'm saying. You're welcome. I to resume my travels, but I must log a few things first, and I owe you a favor. Very nice. I will return to Farling Shrine. Speak with me there. So that I may impart my sorcery. Well, thank you. I'm not big into sorceries, but you never know. You might have something that's so mind-blowing I want to put some points into intelligence. Oh, well, I'll be along later. Anything else? Got to, got to, got to double check. Oh, oh. Well, I did a good deed. I might have taken an innocent life, but I, I also saved an innocent life. I did good. <sighs> right, because that's not a thing. I reckon going into the cage up top will be a thing. You know? Okay. Well, I did good. I wonder what kind of sorcerer is, if there's a particular kind or, or not. Um. Oh, Jesus Christ. Well, that's just death, is what that is right there. I wonder if you can send another boulder coming this way. I wonder if it fills up the forest slowly. Hmm. <laughs> well, cool. I came down here for a sorcery boy and I got one. Anything else in here that's worth my time? I don't think so. I think it's just like... I wonder if that armored, armored guy that I killed would have sent me to find this guy or... Uh, I'm going to wait until I get feedback for this episode because episode, I don't want to Google it and like just to see what would have happened. Um, I'll, I'll let you guys give me feedback. No crazy spoilers, of course, but, you know, I, I do still want to know if I majorly fucked up by killing that guy. Now, is that water down there with that Titanite demon? Because I, I wonder if I can survive falling down, you know. I, I'm going to go ahead and guess here that that's a big old no. But, uh, I mean, you never know. Well, I've, I've done most of the shit now. 
Come at me, bruh. Can oh, can I shoot him? <laughs> what a glorious idea I had. Okay. Well, I can freely try and go all the way back up and climb in that cage that I was just talking about. That's always an option. Other than that, I can't think of anywhere else to go particularly. I'd like to find Onion Head, and I can't think of where I haven't been yet, you know? Uh, there was a bunch of shit up on the roof. Um, I think I got everything up on the top of the roof. There was an item there, but it was... Oh, is this thing here again? I need to... Right, okay. I've got this. Let's not get caught on any wall, you know what I mean? Let's not get caught on anything. I've got this. There! Ooh! Ho, 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 fucking hell! <gasps> Jesus! That was fucking close. Right, let's send them into the abyss. Okay. Uh, I'm guessing that boulder will just roll all the way off the edge, that's fine. That's an edge. This direction is also an edge. Uh, I guess the only place to go is back up again and try that cage. Um, failing that, if there's truly nothing else. If there's truly nothing else, I can just try and descend back to the start of this place and... Uh, because that's the lowest place above the Titanite Demon, and I'll see if there's somewhere jumping down. Maybe in that room where it's quite open, and I got that that ring. Maybe there's a way of falling down there. But let's try the cage at the top first. Uh, it, hang on, is this the one where there's a gap in the middle or not? No, right, okay. Whee! Is that fucker back? I need to rest of the thing again. I've got no flaskage. It's all good. It's just a man going for a walk. I don't know. Where the fuck was that cage? It was up top, wasn't it? No hesitation. I still think it was like, oh, that guy's back again. Uh, shall I try killing this guy again? Now I've got the uh, increased um, item discovery. Maybe these guys drop something. And now I've got a much better chance of uh, dropping it, you know? I've got no health potions, by the way, so this is, uh... Yeah, this might be a fool's errand, <laughs> since I've got no health. I can always... That's it, bitch. Any drops? Oh, there's gotta be something. Oh. Ah, oh, well. I've always got those new awesome divine health potions, but I'd rather save those for, like, panicking in a boss fight. Do you reckon I can run and jump over to that? Oh, fuck that. No, no, I can't. Oh, hang on. Too slow, too slow, too slow. You need to time this quite well. Ooh. Now let's see if this is a thing. Um, it is. Hey, okay, I've done something. 
with zero flasks. <laughs> this might be a big old mistake. Okay. Thank you. Now just hang on a second. Uh, where are we? Um. This was the f beginning of this place, wasn't it? Didn't, didn't we first come past one swingy boy and then past two swingy boys or four? And you got your titanite demon below. I can jump down there. I know I can survive that fall. Uh... I'm just avoiding dropping down to titanite demon hell with no health and no flasks. I should probably not be a billy bastard. I should, uh... I should rest out of fire, really. But I can't lie. A part of me is wondering if I can actually... If I've got the skill to fight a titanite demon and win the fight without any health or flasks. <laughs> Just because I'm a piece of shit. With stupid ideas. Fuck it. Uh, that's the way up again. Okay, let's try and drop down here then. It's quite a fall, but I can survive that. Then I just need to kill two snaky fucks. In fact, can I actually... Are they hurting each other? No. I'm wondering if I can fireball from up here. What happens if I do this? Oh, it doesn't go down low enough. Gotcha. Well, you know what, some- there's- there's- there's-, there's WHAT?! I've got no health and I'm dead. I didn't see a third one under me. Uh, right, okay. There's a stairs over there. Is that the- is that the official way down? Um... I'm not gonna kindle the fire just yet. There is other ways down here, like- Oh, fucking hell, what a complete fail of a human I am! Jesus. <laughs> I'll try that again, but that's that doesn't seem like the correct way down to me. But there's very other there's very little choice otherwise, to be honest. Well, I got down to the Titanite demon, eh? Hello, I did, I did three damage to his tail. <laughs> All right. All right. Okay. Fine. Hey, I've got one flask back. Just, just, just like that. Hey, worth it. <sighs> Fuck me. Okay. Right. What is the crack here? Um. You've got three motherfuckers underneath me. I can actually f potentially fall on one. Um. Can I do Chaos Storm and it will land down there with them? Do you reckon that's a thing? I, w I need that guy fucker to die. Um. Still got that loot up there. What's down here? Oh my god. Right, this is back to the start. <laughs> oh, fuck. Oh my god, man. Oh. I think I might need to just call it a, a day. This is just fucking diabolical.
Don't get pushed off, you fucker. You piece of shit. You piece of shit. I'm just going to go for this, but... Uh, you are under duress as soon as you're down there. They're all casting at you. That's it. Two out of three, done. Three out of three, and that guy's still firing away, but that's fine. I can just keep on the move. Keep on the move. I've got two flasks. Flamberg. I've got a Flamberg, ladies and gentlemen, and I'm safe behind here. We've got some Flamberg action going on. Right, I can jump down now, but I'll be in a fight with a titan like Demon! Oh, Jesus. Um, let's just plan my move. These guys aren't that tough. As long as there's nothing else firing at me, I can kill him quite easy. I'll use the pillars to block your magic. Uh, I've got this, even with two flasks. I've got this. Um, I fucking got this. Come on, I need some confidence, man. Two, man, they they're not firing yet. It's all good. Um, right, yeah, okay, that's fine. That's fine. Let's equip the ring that lets me fucking move. I'm hoping it does. That one. Yes, that worked perfectly. Oh, what a necessary ring that is. I'll fight and kill this one that's on my ass first. I, do, I reckon there's mo there might be more than two, you know. Fuck, he's hitting me through that wall. Oh my god, man. At least I can block the fucking attacks. That's fine. Let's get some distance over here. I'm glad that's a dead snake that's right there. I can actually block a full hit with, with my current stamina. Etc. Get some stamina back. I'm glad only one's attacking me. What would you do here if you didn't have the ring, by the way? That rusted ring? You'd be absolutely fucked. Like, fucked. Oh, thank God I'm using a shield, eh? One more. There we go. That's one dead. There is a way out of here. Um. Oh, ah, oh, demon titanite. Now, let's make sure there's no traps. But where's this going? I might as well check real quick. Oh, I was hoping I'd do the Sense Fortress in one episode, but I've been here for, like, literally three-plus hours. <laughs> Jesus. Oh. Uh, oh, right, okay, I see. There's the loot. That, that so looks like it should be an illusory. What the fuck? Right. Okay. Okay, that, uh, that's the second example in, in the same episode of rolling doesn't always work on the illusory walls. I had to actually fucking attack that. I'll tell you what, how about this as a game plan going forward? I'll roll at basically every wall, as I am doing, but the ones that particularly look like they should be an illusory wall and aren't with rolling, that's, those are the few that I will hit with my weapon. Is that a good plan? I don't- I, I can't be swinging my weapon at every wall, because I'll just destroy my weapon. But ones like this, that- that particularly, like, looked like a fake wall. It even had, like, a different colour. Um... Jesus. Well, let's go up and see, I guess. I will go back down, but... Come on, there's gotta be something up here. Hello? Oh. 
Okay. Well, I want... I'd prefer to fight Titanite before I fight big old fuckhead. Are they all arseholes? Oh, can I lock onto him? Let's sneak up. I can. I mean, why would you not? They're tossing bombs at my ass. I've got two flasks. Uh... Whoa! Fucking hell! He's going ha He's going ham! He's going fucking ape shit! He's going ham! I'm stuck, man! Oh, attack him! Attack him! He's literally trapped me! Let's heal as well. It's just you and me. Let's just hug. Let's just hug it out, man. Jesus. Fuck my life. Titanite truck. I should probably put that other ring back on. The, uh... The item drop rate thing. Well, I got rid of one of them. I'm guessing all these brothers are still alive. That's the bridge out of here. So I'm guessing all of these probably drop a demon titanite chunk or whatever it is. Um, so this illusory wall, I'm guessing, was simply another chunk. But that's fine. Did I just hear something then? Is there anything else? I'm never coming back here again, so let's just... Give it a good once-over. What if I can pull that chain? Um, well, that's a big area of that. Do you reckon I can run and jump? No, that's not a thing. Surely getting on top of this wall isn't a thing. Um... But there's stairs in a big old area over there. Hang on. There's not a fucking wall here, is there? No. Okay. Well, thanks for the shard, but let's go. Let's go kill another de demon thing. A demonite titanite fucking whatever they're called. Why did that guy sort of roll over and trap me in his belly area? Usually monsters wouldn't uh, expose their belly to you like that. Right, okay. I'm glad these guys are actually not that tough, I'll be honest. Once you realise what they do and you can easily kind of block their shit, they're not that bad at all. Um. Should I put on- hang on, should I put on... I need the footing ring on, but should I... Um, should I try switching out Havel's ring, the light- the, the rolling ring or whatever, and putting on the item discovery ring? How heavy am I when I do this? Because it's fucked my, uh, rolling up. Okay. Medium rolling, I'm, ha I'm happy with that. I mean, why not? I just want some extra chance of getting some shit off this guy. Oh shit, oh my bad, my bad, my bad! He ain't that tough, he ain't shit. He ain't shit. You ain't nothing. I've eaten bigger demons than you for breakfast, bitch. Whew. Well. Scythe. Ooh, I'm getting some nice, interesting sounding weapons in this uh, place. Nice, okay. Well, worth it. Now, I don't believe I've seen a way out yet. Um, not count. I suppose that way, that is a way out over there, isn't it? What's over here? 
Any more demons? Hello! Oh, there's two more. Can I pull this one over here? Because I don't want to fight two at once. Oh, fuck. That's bad. <sighs> Alright, I've got both on me now. I can't be fighting two at once. I'd have to... Uh... Is he gonna hit his friend? Yes, he is. No, he's not! He goes right through the fucking friend. Okay. Um... Can I lose him, officially? By running away? What happens? Let's have a sippy sip. Have I lost him? <sighs> this is not good. You know, it's funny, I was point blank there and he didn't actually hit me with a swing. Whoa, that's not fair! Come on now! That's not fair at all. What the fuck? I'm dead, yeah, I'm dead. <laughs> You know, that's not even worth doing. Ow! Oh, come on. Oh my god, these tough- these- These fuckers are easy until there's more than one. And then you're fucked. What the fuck, man? Oh my god! What sort of angle did he have on me there? <laughs> He didn't. That was that was what angle he had there. Bull shit. Man Serpent Greatsword. Ooh. Is that any good? Jesus, look at all these weapons I've been getting. Man Serpent Greatsword. Uh, requires 24 strength. I've got that just. Strength scaling B. Ooh, this might end up being a really good weapon. Greatsword, regular. This single bladed, blood stained greatsword is the choice weapon of the slithering serpent men of Sen's fortress. An ordinary human will have great difficulty swinging this heavy beast effectively. Don't worry, I'm not just any person. I'm a complete fuckwit, so I can wield it just fine. I don't know if I can do this. I think I've reached the, the limit of my capacity to not suck ass. <sighs> you know, I've been th I've been wondering if this is actually possible, and I think it might actually be possible to just run down like this. That would have saved me a headache. It is possible, isn't it? Yes, it is. Fuck's sake, what an easy... Oh, my God. Okay. Right, at least I've got an easier way down. <laughs> Alright, good news, bad news. The bad news is I've died to those fuckers down there a million times. The good news is I've learned there's nothing down there except those fuckers. <laughs> so I'm never going down there again. Unless I specifically need demon shards. I ain't never going back down there, so... There's one simple truth I must face. That is not the way to go. I thought a descending might be the way to go, just genuinely. Um, but it wasn't. So where else is there to go in this place? That's the important question. Jesus. Did 
Did I go up here? Earlier. Did I come up? Hang on a second, did I not come up here earlier? Sorry, I'm just, I've probably just skipped ahead to you guys. Uh, I'm not sure, I've just been wandering around. Um, I've just been wandering around trying to find anything new or whatever. Did I not come up here? How oh my god, okay. Oh, Jesus. Well, I think we found where to go. But I need to, I need to haul some serious ass here. And not fall off at the same time. Jesus. Well, there you go. Hello. Oh, right, I see. Okay. Um, that's a big motherfucker right there, is what that is. <laughs> um... Now, do you reckon I should go human b before I get here? I'm extra tempted to say yes because I've actually just, by pure chance, I've just got a soft humanity right now. That I could use. Here and now. Look at that tough motherfucker. Um. Oh, look at this place. Oh. I don't know how how much I've edited that down for you guys, but I was trying to fight those demons down in that pit for at least a good hour, because I kept dying and it kept taking me ages to get back down there again. Uh. Is there any point to this building whatsoever? Uh. Hmm. Oh, very interesting visual. Uh, dude. Well, let's go turn human then, because if there is an invader in Sense Fortress, now's the time, because that, that's surely the final boss of this place. But let's just see if we can kill this motherfucker. Before. Right, he's right here, isn't he? Fucking hell, he's bigger than the other one. Right, let's, uh, let's heal. And see if I can kill him. I can't even- Bruh. No, 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 no. Uh, although... Although... I don't want to go human, come back here, and it turns out I've got to kill this guy. I think I might want to commit to this. Um... Let's commit to this, and then, uh, yeah, if I die, I die. Right, I'm, I think I'm gonna roll, cause there ain't no fucking, ain't no block in this guy's attacks. So that's two hand. You missed, you big ugly shit. Let's get between his legs, he seems extra weak between his legs. Until he stomps. Well, he, he slapped me, but he died at the same time. It was it was worth the sacrifice of getting hit. Right. Okay. Thanks for the chunk. There's still one more of those fucks down there. Look at this. Ooh. If you tell me gargoyles are going to attack me mid-fight, you can fuck yourself. Ooh. Okay. Those pots ain't shit. So yeah, everyone's feedback has basically been, any place there is an invader, it's pretty much before the boss. I don't know if it, that means right before the boss, or just vaguely before the boss. Um... But now's the time. If there's an invader in this place, you know what I mean? Then it's here. So let's get back to the campfire, I guess. It's not that far away. Uh, and I've killed that fucker, so I can wander about freely without getting bombarded by blasty bitches. Um, oh, fuck off. 
Something tells me you can't kill that one. Right, let's just drop straight down. Hang on, where is it? There it is. Should I put extra humanity in or should I just go human? Uh, let's... Let's just go human, hey? Oh, uh, well, I've rested. Let's do this. That's the first soft humanity I've got, by the way, from this entire place. I thought you were supposed to get, like, up to ten per place or something. Right, we're human. Let's try and survive now. It shouldn't be that difficult. He's not up there, is he? No, okay. I'm guessing these fuckers aren't the sort of enemies that respawn. But this little shooty fucker is up there. I'm looking forward to the next time I see an invasion because it's... I've only seen the one down in Blighttown and that's it. I'll be kind of upset now if actually there is an invasion here. Because it means there basically isn't an invasion in Sen's Fortress. And I've wasted a humanity. Don't stop firing at me. Stop firing. Okay, well, I mean, ain't no invasion, is there? <laughs> Interesting. Well, I didn't waste the humanity, necessarily. Because, uh... Oh, ah, this is your summon place. Um, is this or is this not the motherfucker I, ac I accidentally killed? <laughs> I didn't waste the humanity because I, it was soft anyway, so if I die, I would have lost it regardless. But I guess let's just go in the boss door. Um, or at least go up. Oh, I'm wondering if there is a, an invasion somewhere in Sen's Fortress, but it's just not here, right immediately in front of the boss door, but it's further back somewhere. It's not the biggest problem. You lose a few humanity in like a weapon or something, but... You know, shit. It's fine. Worst things have happened. Hello, boss. Tough motherfucker. Iron Golem. I'm not scared of you. I'm sorta of scared of you. Is shield gonna help, or is it just too big for the shield? Between the legs? He's got me by the scruff of my neck. Ow. <laughs> okay. Shit, man. I need to heal. So far, he's done one double attack. <gasps> Ooh. I'm too far away. Ooh, that leap forward he does before that attack is a pain. You know what? I'm not going to lock on. Ow! What? 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 Well, fuck you then. Oh my god. I should have. I should have. I should have kindled this motherfucker. Uh, it's it's fine. Fuck it. But I'm not human anymore. That that dream is gone. I'm still curious about how to get to this, because I cannot for the life of me figure out any way down to there. Um But let's let's just kill the iron bitch. And I can always come back here later. 
It's not as big a ball lake as the catacombs this place to sort of backtrack through it. Uh, I can't tell if the shield is a good thing. I don't think it is. I don't think he's got any attacks that I can actually block. Worth a damn. Um, I think I'm gonna just two-hand. Just roll. What the fuck was that? I forgot I had the wrong ring on. Um, I don't know what ring I've just put on. I think I've got drop rate and... Don't roll off the edge. It doesn't have that much health, or I'm doing a lot of damage, it's one of them. Power attack. Oh, I just stumbled him. Do you see that? And again, power attack. Fuck it. Oh, get fucked. I'm guessing there isn't a special attack here. Can I hit his penis? His penis! Oh my god. Uh, stamina, stamina, stamina. One more, one more. It's Chaos Storm finisher. <laughs> Core of an iron golem. Now that's how you kill a motherfucker. Okay, that's how you fucking kill a son of a bitch. Yes! Yes! Humanity. Got a shiny boy. Hang on, before we examine that, okay, and end the world. Did I just get something? I, I, I was too busy celebrating in my own mind. Did I get something else? I got that, didn't I? Right, so that's sort of the, one of your special things. Gotcha. Um. Okay. I'm wondering now, can you... In this game, can you just do such heavy damage that you stun any boss in the game? As long as you do sufficient, like, super high damage. Because I stumbled him then, and he was basically out for, like, 40 seconds. I could do whatever I wanted to him and easily kill him. Um, this is a weird looking wall door thing. <laughs> Gotta try. Well, let's I'm not I'm not here to not click on the fucking ring of light. Let's click it. I never did see um what's his face? The the onion head. Have I sort of missed him somewhere? I only saw him the one time and then I sort of I deactivated the balls coming his way and then just I never saw him again. Which is kinda odd. And the summon thing wasn't for uh, to summon him, it was to summon the guy I accidentally killed. Uh are those two shards that I forgot to pick up. Boulder leggings and Titan shard indeed. Right, let's touch this light and see what the fuck happens. <sighs> Cutscene. Oh, big progress. Shame I didn't kill him first. Oh, fuck off. Oh, good God, no. Hello. Group hug? Where are they flying me? Ooh, we're going upwards towards the rest of the castle I saw. Are, are these friendly bats? Ooh, dude, that's beautiful. What the fuck is this place? Thanks for the lift, friendly bat monsters. Dude. Achievement unlocked. Reach Anolondo. Oh, look at this. Bruh. That's 
Okay, that's uh, that's next level. Hello. That is next level. Look at this motherfucker. I'm getting similar vibes. Sorry for the compar comparison again, but I'm getting similar vibes to the first time I saw the royal capital in Elden Ring. Just, just like mind blowing. Except this, if anything, looks even better. Just because of the scale. Look at this motherfucker. Um. You know what? I'm gonna take my camera off. My my ugly old mug is not needed when you've got this beautiful sight. Look at this shit. Um. This might end up being your thumbnail. <laughs> uh. <laughs> I'm just trying to guess a anything worthy of a thumbnail, you know? I mean, to be fair, that's a pretty fucking- that's such a good thing, I'm gonna, uh... I'm gonna Steam screenshot that, that's pretty beautiful, you gotta admit. There you go, just a man looking over the horizon. Oh, yes. Right, okay. That's beautiful. So this is the fabled Anor Londa we've been hearing so much about. By the way, this is the place where that uh, item is to be used. That. That black eye shit from Golden Boy, I assume, and the firekeeper, that whole situation. Invade the world of a murderer of a firekeeper to defeat the perpetrator and reclaim the soul of the firekeeper. The Black Eye keeps constant watch on the city of the gods and Orlando. Right. I can't use it. Um. Now, is that because I'm in the wrong place? Most likely. Or is it because I'm not human, etc.? Because I know some other orbs are like PvP summony sort of things which I've put away. Um, we'll see. I've got all of this place to, to play before I can worry about that shit. Oh my god, I might have to end the episode here. It's been like 4 hours 20 minutes total. I'm sure I can edit some of that out. Uh, I'll tell you what, let's keep going. It is a per perfect place to stop though. In as much as... I mean, we've seen the beautiful sight of this place, and next time we get to look forward to, uh... ...to tackling this motherfucker, but I'd like to stop at a campfire if possible, and maybe spend those runes on leveling up. Hello! Oh, you ain't- you ain't shit! Shh! If I die, do I appear back down at Sen's Fortress? Ooh... You- this guy ain't shit, compared to the golem I just killed. No, he's not- he's not having a go. Hello? Ah! I like that halberd he's got, uh, is- that looks the spitting image of the golden halberd from Elden Ring. <laughs> okay, well, let's run inside past him. Can I block one of his attacks? Let's try. Oh, that's nothing! Okay, that's something. Jesus, that's- that's a lot. This guy ain't shit! What? Oh god, this guy's- this guy's gonna kill my ass. Let's go two-handed and just dodge. How am I not hitting him? How's that not hit again? Am I missing something here? There, fuck you. By the way, that that was a beautiful looking uh, guy, I've got to say. Shiny and golden. Dude. Oh, somebody did comment last episode saying don't use cursed fire on golden boys. Are these, are these the golden boys they're on about? They are pretty golden. Um, I'm fine just f f sorting them anyway, to to be honest. Uh, they don't seem to get pissed off until you're really close. Is there any reason that halberdy swordy thing on that statue is a different colour? That looks like an interactable item. Wall? No, okay. 
Okay. Well, I don't want to unnecessarily just kill shit for the sake of it. Um, slight... Oh, there's a treasure, right? I see. Okay. Well, I can come back if I need to. It's weird that they only aggro when you're very close to them. Dude. Oh my god, look at the sight, man. Bruh. Never mind sight. Look at the fucking sight of this place. You got a bastard golem down there. Um, oh. Oh. There doesn't seem to be any easy way back, though. I've got to say, now I'm done with Sen's Fortress. I mean, I assume you can speak to that demon fucker up top and fly back down, but... I kind of don't want to until I've done this area now. So this is definitely next episode. Um, I just want to continue. Ah, uh, there's the campfire I ordered. Uh, oh, hello. Oh my god, there's so much to look at. Can I stand on the edge and get a, like, an even better screenshot? Whoa! An even better thumbnail. Is this an elevator? Okay, we're committed now. We're, we're, we're fucking down now. This is it. Fuck the screenshot, apparently. Oh, shit, my god. The, the delay is a killer. Right, so we can go down, and that leads straight across the bridge, I believe, to there. It led out to there, where the golem is. The shiny golden golem, by the way. Oh, not golem, uh, gargoyle. That leads to there, which... Oh, no, it doesn't lead to those stairs, does it? It leads off to the side somewhere. Okay. Bro, look at the scale of this. You've got buildings all the way to the edge. And all of this is on top of the mountain that's out of sight. From the rest of the entire game, you can only see the walls on the top of this cliff. And all of this is hidden behind it. Bruh. Right, okay. Forgive me. But, you, but, but can you blame me? Okay. Can you blame me when you've got a sight this beautiful? I only wish you could t uh, turn the UI off. So I've got a, a you know, just a, just a frame like this, but without the uh, health bar and shit on. But it is what it is. Look at that for a fucking view. Again, I've got to screenshot that on Steam. That's fucking beautiful. In fact... I'll just keep my camera off for a second. I've got to put on the boar helmet. You know what I'm saying? Desperate times call for desperate, beautiful measures. Uh, <laughs> hang on. <laughs> Whee! Hang on, let's uh, get the, the sun bloom. In fact, that's actually a really good framing picture there. That might have to be the thumbnail. Just a man with a boar head, a nice shield and a great sword, with a fucking crazy royal capital behind his shoulders. Right, okay, that's it. Enough wasting your time. Um, let's go back to that campfire and rest, and we'll call it an episode, and we've got all this shit to look forward to next time. The start of the next episode, I'll be killing these four, or more than four, um, sentinels. And we'll try and loot that chest and, and so on. There's a chest down in there as well. So that's next time. Uh, do we end up going back? You know the, where the dragon is on the bridge and he lights the bridge on fire? And there was that campfire that... Uh, past the open gate that we could never reach. Is that in our future? Or is it connected to this place? Like... Uh... Please don't disappear. There we go. Hello there, Mr. Golden Boy. Well... Oh, Golden Girl. Sorry. Welcome to the lost city of Anorlondo. Chosen undead. Thank you. If you seek Lord Gwyn's old keep, exit here and head straight yonder. If you are the Chosen One, 
a revelation shall visit thee. What follows thereafter depends upon you. I like her helmet. Oh, oh, she's a firekeeper. She's a firekeeper. I'm a, okay, right. Hmm, what is it? What am I? Well, I am the keeper of the bonfire. If not for me, what beacon would there be in this lost city? A true keeper and a guide. That is my calling. Do, do you know who holds the soul of your friend? The bonfires attended by the keepers are special. Okay. They are linked to one another, and their flames never die. Okay. Yet never shall the keepers of these flames meet. Oh. Why, why are these bonfires special? If you require rest, now is the time. That is, after all, what the bonfire is for. Any more? She's got lots of info for me. If you require rest, right, okay. that is... Oh, I've got ten flasks. Somebody did say in a comment, and I didn't believe him, <laughs> that all your firekeeper bonfires are ten without a kindling. And there's proof right there that they are correct. Cool. I don't have any firekeeper souls, do I? No, okay. If you require okay. rest... Well, let's just rest. I mean, I don't see why we shouldn't... Uh, level up. Don't want to die and lose these runes. I've lost more runes this episode than I've gained, even with this 40-something thousand. I've lost so many. Um, let's blast one into strength, because I want to start doing more damage. And I reckon... Uh, I reckon another health. There you go. Bosh. I would have spent those on, like, upgrading pyromancy, but, you know, I'm nowhere near a pyromancer. Oh, you know, I forgot how freeing it is to roll around with no armor on. Even though I've got a very heavy helmet on, by the way. Um, fuck, I don't want to stop, man. Legit. I just want to keep going, um... Let's have a peek in here. <laughs> We're going on four and a half hours. I need to stop, like, desperately. Uh, otherwise, it'll take, like, three days for the video to fucking render. Never mind, upload and process and shit. Um, do you reckon I can grab that chest? Oh, there's two chests. All right, bring it on, motherfuckers. Oh, oh, oh. I don't even have armor on now. Uh... Can I get them away from the chests? They are slow as shit. Go, 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 go. <laughs> Another weird looking statue. Hello. Oh, fuck off, man. I'm dead. I'm dead. That's it. Goodbye. Goodbye, life. That's what I get for not ending the episode. It's a good thing I had no ru runes to, uh, souls to lose. I did notice that the chests were two different colors, by the way. I was... I didn't comment on it, but I noticed. I wonder if that's a telltale sign that one of them is a monster. Or if it's just random colours. Um, see, the one on the left is brown, but that one... The, the monster one is, was like more silvery white colour. Alright, bring it on. I'd love to find a golden halberd in this game. Come on, you slow motherfuckers. Do, 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 do. Ba -do, -ba -do, -do. Ba -do, -ba -do -ba. Walking in a winter wonderland. Let's get this chest before I get my 1,000 measly runes back. Twinkling tie tonight. Oh! Goodbye, life. I mean, I'm literally sucking his golden cock right now. Fucking get out my face. Uh, I want my runes back, even if it's just 1,000. Um, fucking hell, the range of these fools! Let's, let's not click on the chest, let's click on that. Um, 
there. Right. Watch the fuck out. Oh, for fuck's sake. Oh, he ate me. Oh, no, oh, no. Oh, okay. Not only do I have to deal with multiple swinging golden cocks just dangling in my face, blocking my view, can't see what the fuck's going on, rolling between multiple pairs of legs, I'm being eaten by some gangly motherfucker. Right, let's, 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 let's just... I got the, uh, upgrade item for the sword. Uh... Oh. Oh, shit, man, you need four Twinkling Titanite to get to plus five. But let me know if plus five is the maximum for these Black Knight weapons. Because I've got a feeling it is. Anyway. Uh, yeah, we're done. Thanks for joining me for this episode. Uh, we completed Sans Fortress, which is what I wanted to do. Do you know what I mean? I was worried, honestly, going on like three and a half hours, I was worried I was just going to be halfway through Sense Fortress, which would be a real just shame, just in terms of progress and episodes on YouTube. It, it's nice to finish an area by the end of an episode, so this is absolutely fucking perfect. Um, it seems to be a running theme with me dying to main bosses once and then killing them on my second attempt. If I'd have been paying a little more attention, I, I could have killed him first time, but I failed again. Damn it. I like to think at some point I will one-shot some of the important bosses. Mm. At least I killed that iron fucker with style, with a chaos storm. Well, that's it. Like this video if you liked it, like this video if you didn't like it, and subscribe for similar content. Oh, all my social media links in the description, including my brand new Instagram, where you can see pictures of my cat. And I have a Patreon if you want to go above and beyond to support my content. That's the best way to do so. Uh, I've had a bunch of queries in this episode. If you've got answers or feedback for any of my questions, that's greatly appreciated. Um, things like, let me know which of the many weapons I've got are really fun and great to use, and I might consider upgrading those ones. Um, I've had a million questions over the last few hours, but I can't, I can't remember any of the others. Um, yeah, I'll catch you guys in the next episode. Liquid Blitz, out. Out.